Oh shit, nigga. He could see it. Diddy could see it. Like, nigga. Everybody see that Ross. shit. You, you could be Ross. You could be Biggie. I want some goddamn. Hey, pillow, nigga. <laughs> Y'all niggas all right over there? Oh, yeah. We getting, getting situated. About the pillow fight and shit? Oh, Shut the fuck up. That's some white. That's some white. That's some light skin. Y'all niggas, what the fuck y'all niggas got going on? Nigga with a kickback on Friday night's a pillow fight. I can't explain it. We back another week. Oh, yeah. Oh, oh, you just gonna start off like that. Another episode. Uh, light skin niggas, man. Another episode, BYOB. We here, man. Niggas is uh, recuperating from a crazy weekend. Very I didn't crazy. have a crazy weekend. I sat in the fucking house all weekend, dude. My legs were fucked up. I was around a lot of women who were jiggling ass and shaking their ass in the pool. And it was very amazing. Shout out to Joe for the yeah, birthday shout party. Out to Joe, man. Yeah, the pool party was definitely a success, man. Like big success. Everybody came out. We had a good time, and I guess he got some more in store for y'all. So it's a filthy family affair, man. Don't yeah, ever filthy forget. family business. Watch this party where you can get it rocking. Always. Right. <laughs> Always. <laughs> That's life. When you're in Virginia, man, look us up. Yeah, man, all the times, man. Yeah. Or we might be in the city near you because we travel too. Yeah. yeah. Yes. We about to start these live podcasts real soon. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Real system. fucking soon. Protect your fucking neck. Yeah. This shit's about to get real. <laughs> <Everything>. <laughs> Protect your fucking neck. So, yeah, man, we got a lot to go over this week. A lot a of lot shit happened. Too, and motherfucking happened, didn't happen. A lot of music dropped. Y'all need to y'all need introduce ourselves to the people that ain't seen this shit before. Oh, damn. Yeah. We got I'm a couple so of viewers, it. but we gaining new people. Of Niggas course need to know, know. y'all are. Oh, yeah. I am your host. Regular job. Kyle, hey, yo, 80 proof. That's it. Yeah, you got, yeah, you got like 37. Pot, Smokey Robinson, Petty Pendergrass, whatever you want to call me, man. We here. And then we got a special guest this week. He this yeah, is man. this ain't his first time at the rodeo. You he, seen you seen me a couple of times. He done been here talking Filthy about family. Always. Ace Boogie. I'm here. Somebody know me as Jared. If your bitch know me, she know me as James B. Tabernacle the third, adult <laughs> film star. Like, yeah, man. AKA Pizza Hut. <laughs> Deliver on site. If, I don't, if, I don't if, even if, know what that means. Now, you know, like, if you don't, I can't, I'm trying to say this without motherfucking saying it, but Pizza Hut is a contact to somebody's phone. They ain't never Pizza oh, Hut. Oh, oh, oh. <laughs> so we switch, we switch, <laughs> we switch to Cox Cable now. <laughs> Pizza Hut. In, the, in the <laughs> <laughs> Dominion Energy, I'm laying cable, laying pipe. Pizza, <laughs> things, yeah. things Pizza different. Pizza Hut came too obvious. Shit Niggas yards. started catching on. <laughs> so but, yeah, man. Uh, yeah, man. We here, man. Another BYOB episode, man. Make know. sure y'all like, subscribe, sure, hit subscribe. subscribe on the YouTube page, man. We need y'all. Y'all know what we coming with, man. We every definitely time. need y'all to hit the subscribe button. Yes, sir. So, y'all ready to get into this music, Let's, man? Yeah, we, we gotta start with music. I mean, one of the biggest albums of the year fucking dropped. Look, this nigga's cheesing hard. I told, I've been wait. telling y'all <laughs> can't wait for months. I've been I telling y'all niggas, too. I told niggas, niggas, too. Ross dropped this summer. <laughs> that shit gonna be unstoppable. It is. He gave you the album of fire. Yeah, I mean, Crazy. Pure Fire, Port of Miami, too. <laughs> Crazy. If you haven't heard it yet, you better get hip. Because, I mean, the whole album is fire. It's not a classic album, but it's no, a it's not. Very, but it's a very, very but it's a good solid album. album. What it is is a fucking Ross album. It's a, it's Ross. a Ross. It's, it's very it's much a Ross, Ross album. album. Like it's exactly what you expect out of a fucking Ross album. Exactly. Everybody that I talked to said, "Yo, that album made me want to sit on a beach with a cigar, <laughs> a glass of yak, and just live life. You got just it. watch life." He did it. He that motivational yeah. music, man. And before we get into the review of the album. Just shout out Gunplay, just because it's Oh, fun. yes. One time. <laughs> man, hey, look. Shout out Gunplay, I've been man. trying to tell niggas for too long, man. I tried to tell y'all niggas about Nip. I tried to God, tell nobody. niggas about Mozzie. I tried to tell niggas about a lot of niggas, man. And I yeah. tell you, my nigga Gunplay, yeah. he was waiting for this for a lot. Fire. Since Port of Miami 1, he been waiting. Yeah. And he been sleeping, but I'm telling you, Gunplay, on Gunplay nobody's can, favorite. Gunplay can rap. He yeah. can rap. His ass off. He can rap his ass <laughs> off. But no, like, there's no reason for a, a nigga that wild to be that good at rapping. Yeah. So we and got. I think he got back on the cocaine. 
And I'm okay with that. And I'm fine I'm with okay it. With I'm, that. I'm 100% fine We got to get that. Gunplay Line before he raps. I'm cool with that. And then he was talking big boy dope shit on that, on that yeah. track. Oh Jesus Christ. No, him on cocaine is like Weezy on the, on the lane. On the lane. Yeah. Bring like, Weezy lane back. <laughs> yeah. Bring, yeah. yeah. You got to bring that like lane. We, Mary J on drugs. I don't want to hear Mary J on Mary J on drugs. Yeah. Mary that's that's when she used to fight the nigga in Jodeci. I need high ass Mary J with the broken heart. She got to come out of a like, I don't, relationship. I don't want a happy Mary J. Black. We don't want no more drama, Mary yeah. J. We want drama, Mary J. <laughs> that family affair shit was cool, but that no more drama, Mary J. Let's get it percolating. Yeah. <laughs> I mean, it was cool. she invented her own word in that shit, so Perkin niggas ain't never heard of a dancery. Yeah, they don't do that. Niggas ain't never heard of a dancery before that song. She That's just the made club, it. nigga, the she dancery. Just, but nigga, we, we know what it is, but nobody knew what the fuck it was. Like, who the fuck just... <laughs> If I she hit really niggas, said dancer. Dick. <coughs> Let's get it crunk up on. Have she, fun up on. Up she did say dancer. <laughs> she definitely made that. Her and Kanye be coming up with fucking words. Yep. Yeah, that nigga Kanye just, he just mumble shit out. Yeah. Whatever I'm going to do new now. He got that Kardashian in him. That, yeah. shit, that shit make you do wild shit. But yeah, track one. At oh. the food. Wale. Okay. I will confess. Intro track. I'm going to say this. I will confess. When he first leaked Act the Fool, mm-hmm. I was very disappointed because of the hook. Not because of the verse. That is precise. Not, not because that. of the I verse. That for sure. Not it because of Wale verse, but because of the hook. The hook was kind of like, all right. But then I put that shit on my car and I rode to it and I was the like. The beat just yeah, knocks. You know it doesn't even matter. It's just, yeah. The crazy thing is, when I listened to the album, I didn't know that that was going to be the first song on the album. It didn't seem so like. So as soon yeah, as I started it, the it, album. It really don't. It's not an fit, intro no, song. Yeah, it no, don't, it don't fit as an intro track. But, but when it came on, I forgot until the hook came on that that was that song. <laughs> that was that song. I forgot. I was like, I was like, play Alexa, play Port of Miami. Too. <laughs> hey, look, it's like, okay. And then as soon as that shit came on, I said, hey, this nigga go. It's, it's about to be another one. And then when the hook came on, I was like, this was that track. Yeah. yeah. I felt the same way. When I first heard it, I, I told my homie, I was like, you know, he probably could have left that off the album. But then I put that shit on in the whip, and I was riding, and that shit started, and I was like, you know what? This really isn't a bad song. Yeah, yeah it's not. It's not a bad it's song. It's not at all. I still a little iffy on the hook. On the hook. But, but the rest of the song Wale did his thing on that one. Yeah. Every we, feature he had was, was dope. Damn, so. right. Then we, we transitioned into Turnpike Ike track two. I, I love Turnpike Ike because it was raw spitting. Yeah, and then and honestly, spitting. I like I like the part where the bitch came in. It's like I'll die for you. Yeah, yeah, I, was yeah, like, yeah. I was like, yo, he always right get now. the shorty to do the Mac- Maybach music. Yeah. This music is sweet. To talk like, shit on sweet. that. Get on the talk that shit. Like Damn that's what right. you get money for. That's what you Damn rich. Right. And tell was, white women to do whatever you want them to do. I was kind of <laughs> facts. <laughs> facts. Yo, facts. Hold on. Number one, rich. white joints are so easy. Mm-hmm. Even the ones that act like they hood and the ones that act black and all that shit, like they still a white girl on the inside. It's different when you when you black, you know you got that factor. You know this ain't you know this ain't what you need to be doing. Yeah. Shout out to all my white women out there too. This is for the me. bunny, no, the I bunny love lord. This. I love it's the bunny lord, lord right here. You love it. It's 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 fun. <laughs> It's fun. Everything is good. Make sure you subscribe. Make sure you like. Make sure you like. Make sure you like y'all. <laughs> See, I smoothie transition. Yeah. Yeah, hey, this shit is fun, but make sure you like. Make sure you subscribe. Got to. I really thought he was about to hit the LL. <laughs> <laughs> Back to Turnpike Ike, though. <laughs> like, when I, when he, was, I, he was talking big boy shit. When I heard Turnpike Ike the first time, I was kind of I felt kind of the same way I did about Act the Fool. I was like, mm-hmm. I'm a little iffy on it. Yeah, was, uh, I'm yeah, still a little iffy on Turnpike Ike. Mm-hmm. So... For me, that that was one out of two. Cause I'm gonna say "Turn by Ike" was that song that I could mm. press skip over. Uh, okay, yeah, yeah, yeah. Okay. I, be, I definitely, I definitely, I definitely agree with that. Like you could skip it if you wanted yeah. to, but yeah. if you skip it, but when you listen you go, to it, he still yeah. he gave but, you bars. But if you skip it, then you go into the next track. With that, with that motherfucking mm-hmm. sample. The, the, hey, look. With that motherfucking sample, "Summer Rain" with "Summer Walker." Yo, that's nah, no, no, it was, it was nobody's it, favorite. It was nobody's oh, favorite. Yeah, favorite sure. No, 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 nobody's no. favorite dropped after that. And, and when nobody's favorite dropped, you heard, yeah, yeah, yeah. you heard from the minute I'm Ross came up. on the track, I'm up. you knew, you yeah. knew at that point in time, it was like, oh, this shit about to get ugly. It and is. I saw Gunplay was on it, so I was yeah, like, I knew it was about know. to happen. And I knew that verse was going to be fine when I saw Gunplay on it, because I mm-hmm. thought about, you mentioned Carol City. That and his, yeah. his verse on the last port of Miami yeah. Oh, yeah. on the song Gunplay. Yeah, Gunplay definitely did. He, he definitely did a uh, power he went circle. Crazy he did on that. Yeah. Shit on that. 
Any song that you really go back and listen to, do you know he has a compilation album with Mozzie? They have their yeah. own joint album, Red and nobody yeah, would listen. To nobody would listen to it. But if you sit there and listen to it, this shit is fire. fire. From beginning yeah. to end, this shit is that fire. Shit is Dreadlocks and headshots. Is, is Shout out to Gunplay, man. Them two niggas. That's <laughs> it, it's a lot. Is that that's <laughs> they shit? That's Carol City. Them shit. two niggas, yeah. Just Mizey and Gun. That's, anyway, I was born to be a killer. <laughs> Be a hustler. <laughs> hey, look, man. When he's doing that one part, at the end, when he was talking sorry, about some argue with the cuss. It's two double. It's two R's and a one G and this triple C. I was like, this nigga, he's it's talking, nasty. He's talking this shit, yo. Hell yeah. Then the, the order that I fucked up on. No, the next song was Summer, summer <laughs> Rain. Yo, that yeah, shit. That summer, sample. That shit. Summer walk into it. As a motherfucker. Never I heard that Summer me. Rain. That's what made me first be yeah. like, you know what? I need to be on the beach. Yeah. I need a cigar. Somebody give me a cognac because he was talking to women yeah. on that song. Crazy. Dog, because that Rain sample. He like, always got them though. That's one of the illest clips I heard on for that sample. Yeah. That he, shit. And that shit. I, I didn't like, and it's funny because soon as the uh, the track start. He don't really bring it in, yeah, and then yeah, when that that, that shit switch and she Damn, come up right. there and you like, oh, <laughs> that is that, and it's like Ross oh. hands down might have the illest production out of any rapper. Mm-hmm. Yeah, no, his yeah. ear for music. His, his, is yeah, retarded. that's what I was about to say. His fucking ear for beats is retarded. His, that's why shout I out to Justice League. That's Justice why League. I need. Yeah, oh, we got to get bro, to that yeah, one. Yeah, that's why I need a fucking Nas album EP by Ross. Yeah, I think that even if it's just an EP. Even if it's a five, yeah. six track EP, it'll give like, us a fire to rap for. They said if Nas was to get a uh, Ross track, or Ross beats, they was like, did you hear him on them? Like, bro, every know. every song that yeah. Ross and Nas be on together, Nas rap his ass off. That's people. like that Ross picked the right beat. Best people motherfucking forget, features. People that triple forget Rich, dreams. For, Rich Forever yeah. Was, yeah. was a mixtape. It wasn't even an album. Yeah. It, it was a mixtape. It should have been. Yeah, that's crazy. How do you make album. a mix? Well, Drake is another one that can yeah. do it. But there are a couple niggas like that. Yeah, they got it. What was yeah. the, I think the next one was big time. Wasn't nah, it? White, line, white line, like oh, with Dage Loaf, yeah. White line, Dage Loaf. Dage always do that, but after he had her on that Maybach, yeah, game, yeah. like it was we like we talked oh, about nah. that last joint. Yeah, I, I, I imagine a pool party going like that yesterday. Not that anybody was going to be doing cocaine at the pool party. Oh, uh, uh, <laughs> but you know, but, uh, the pool party, and cocaine, and they pay, numbers. That's no, the, they played <laughs> nobody's favorite at the pool party. Oh, that shit got nasty. It was why it was ass shaking and splashing. Should have been there. Should have yeah. got tickets. Make sure you get to the next one though. That guy show mighty. Make sure you get to the next that one. That white lines float though. Yeah, it do. It's a vibe. Yeah, it's a vibe. That's that's his shit. When yeah, he get vibe. on when he get on a certain track and he yeah. just be like, alright. And matter I'm let of fact, this shit yo, rock. I could I could possibly safely say that Ross probably has some of the best features with female artists too. He yeah. does. Everybody he does look- his female tracks. You think about it, he got dice pineapples? Yeah. He got the joint with Usher. Yeah, when he talked to him, he talked to him. Yeah, Ask him all that music could... could yeah, you, you got it. And then, and then he got Drizzy yeah, for that yeah. one who just bodied that. Chris Joe was on that shit too, though, yeah. Yep. He don't like to acknowledge it because of the no, Trump no, I mean, shit. No, I'm <laughs> <laughs> he don't want to acknowledge it because of the Trump shit. Hey, this nigga wild. <laughs> this nigga wild. But that shit is like any chick record that he is on, he can, he can do that. Yeah. Like, that's what he can do. So. I got a whole playlist on Spotify of Rick Ross with R and B features on it. It's like thirty songs. Yeah. He got he got a he got a good amount yeah. to where and then when he get up there he talk his he talk his fat nigga shit. Yeah. He talk out his to the fat, fat boys, nigga. nigga. We out here. Yeah. Ross made us live for the summer. You better get you one. Hey, leave them niggas alone. Two fifty and up, you better leave, get you leave one. Leave them niggas alone. They don't love you like that. Hey look. <laughs> They got I too much. You, they got too much to to worry about. I just got to worry hey, about look, you. Get a skinny nigga. Lemon pepper my wings. Get I a love skinny you, nigga. nigga. Number one, <laughs> y'all skinny niggas can holler that shit till it's time <laughs> to carry all the groceries in the house. Yeah. Yeah. Hey, look, that's why niggas got two arms and she got two arms. We doing this together. <laughs> See? That's a shit skinny nigga. Hey, look, you, hey, look, we a team. <laughs> Them niggas only eat for themselves. Never remember that they greedy. <laughs> hey, look, they fat. Hey, one thing about it, we gonna make sure them groceries get in the crib. Hey, look, I know that. You're always gonna eat fucking with a fat nigga. It's always gonna we happen. We gonna baby. make sure. Cause I like to eat, so you gonna eat too. Skinny nigga, you might not eat till he hungry. No. Stomach skinny over there always, Skinny niggas always hungry. You can't take this from us, be it's Port of Miami, it's fat nigga season. Uh, yeah, oh, it's yeah, fat nigga y'all season, got bro. it. Yeah, y'all yeah, do. Yeah. Number one, Ross. this, this, this hey, skinny hold light up, skinny niggas, he, he dropped shit. We gonna talk about shit. later though, cause we got some more shit we gotta get to. But Jeezy dropping the next two weeks. 
And so, uh, and Jeezy, and Jeezy went from a fat nigga to a skinny nigga. We gonna talk so about we gonna, uh, he, ain't, he ain't been the same since. We out here changing lives. He ain't been the I same Jeezy since. I need Ninja Turtle looking Jeezy. This TM, this TM 104 is different. It better be. It's different. I mean, 103, anyway. So we got Bit Time Track 6. Fire. Which is a sleeper Justice League. Fire. Flame. That was one nigga. of the first shits I heard. Yeah. I heard that before I heard At The Food. So. I nah, heard, nah, nah. Yeah. Bit Time is, is, is just Blaze. Yeah. yeah. It's just Blaze. Oh, it was it's just Blaze? Swiss on it. No, who did, uh... It was just Blaze on Big Time. Who? Which one did Justice League do? I don't know. I'm gonna look it up. They had a couple of them. And Justice League just did one. It wouldn't surprise them. me if they did Rich Nigga Lifestyle with Nip. Yeah, they did. Um, they did MM6 too, didn't they? Yeah, I think MM6. Yeah, they, they did, did MM6. MM6. Yeah, yeah, they did MM6. But um, before we get to that, yeah, seven bogus champs, Meek Mill. Usual. Bogus charms. I mean, bogus charms. Yeah, they, yeah, it's usual shit. It's fucking uh. Ross and Meek, and Meek talking they shit. They but they did the shit, shit on Meek album. Yeah, they, the, uh, they, they, they talk I walked into shit. the I walked yeah. into the cell. They let me through the block. Yeah. They told me you can't go in there. Two weeks later. So I got access. Two weeks later. I got access. I got access. Came through with the yellow the Balenciaga. Balenciaga. <laughs> <laughs> These niggas fucking I can hear him all the way down the hall. That nigga was <laughs> screaming too. He I really painted the picture for niggas like the Lamborghini doors. So as soon as I heard as soon as I seen them, as soon as I seen the fucking Soon as I seen yeah. the name of the song, Bogus Charms, yeah. and I know how Meek be talking yeah, about niggas talk, with the fake jewelry and shit, I said, I said, ooh, but he, he's different Meek now. You yeah. know he different Meek now, so I was like, we gonna see we how, gonna get to that too. we gonna see what type oh, of yeah, Meek you too. get. Oh, yeah. I said, we gonna see what type of Meek you get, and we got old school Meek on the shit, me and yeah. Ross, like Meek. Ross passed the alley to me, nigga, I'ma dunk that bitch, like Meek that's what that it shit. is. Did. We got Meek on this motherfucker. Yeah. That won't that won't meet Mill. That was meat. That was meat. Philly <laughs> bull. <laughs> Philly bull. Shout out Philly in the building. Then we got one of my motherfucking personal favorites on this shit. Of course, because you a rich nigga. That rich. My nigga Nip. Because you a rich nigga. That rich nigga lifestyle. You know all about that <laughs> shit. Jesus Nip and Tiana. Man. I could have did without the bridge. Uh, but I like I, that. I like the song. I like the whole song. I like the whole song. <laughs> you got a classic Nip verse. Yeah. 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 I nah, mean, Tiana killed it. It's just the bridge. No, How many the niggas bridge, on your payroll? Really, rich gang I bangers, y'all. You when know I, I took Tiana Taylor really serious as an artist now, that little EP she got with, oh, whatchamacallit, yeah, 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 yeah. that shit was dope. But after this joint, I really considered yeah. her like an artist. She was floating on She was singing. Yeah, nah, she was I singing love, her I ass off on that. I love the hook. And no, then, I mean, when I first heard it, the bridge kind of, I ain't really. Oh, yeah, yeah. But I that gutter really like verse from Nip. It was like yeah, Ross yeah. stepped in there on some. I'm gonna talk this rich nigga shit, yeah. and Nip kind of stepped up there like I'm gonna, I'm gonna hit you with the gutter shit, but I'm gonna hit you with the rich, rich shit too. too. That's too. when Nip always yeah. a good. Balance Only thing we worry about is <laughs> double M's and double Damn, laws. That's what I'm from from his Jeez. first two verses, how many niggas on your payroll, rich yeah. gang banger? You ain't yeah. even know they make those. those. Like that's your mic. <laughs> Ain't too many stick to the code. Yeah. Y'all niggas surprised that Sakashi told I said, well. But he said when he was talking about uh, nigga courtside, nigga went viral. He was courtside. Yeah, put like, yeah, niggas ready to fight. Like, <laughs> R.P. Nip, nip man. Man. Yeah, man. God damn, they that took a nigga. Still, man. That shit still hurt, man. Damn, they took a it nigga. It still hurt because niggas still giving yeah. nip verses nip. here and there. And it's oh. like, God damn. You know how that hard just... that episode, nigga, we, the night he, we had the news, we had yeah. to shoot. Yeah. Like, that shit was one of the hardest episodes yeah, to record, hurt, bro. bro. That shit was like, tough, bro. I told y'all niggas my nigga Nip, if he didn't get that Grammy, it was on some fuck shit. And yeah. y'all see what happened. No, and the crazy thing is, that nigga Nip so classy, he was like, nah, I don't. Don't do that. No, nah, let Shorty have it. Yeah, yeah he was like, let Shorty, let Shorty have that shit. But I'm telling y'all. I know, y'all why, she, know, I know why she won the best rap album. I mean, I mean, we, we, we don't know. know. The same reason why Nikki used to win that sport. Not the Grammy. She never won the Grammy. But yeah. why she won, why she swept every other award. Because she was yeah. every fucking way. Like, yeah. she was a machine. Marissa, shout out to Cardi B and all her yeah. her, her, her people. Because she is out there fucking up everything yeah. right now. And being, and being ratchet. I love that shit. I like that. That's been sad. I got a forty yeah. in my fucking purse. I like <laughs> yeah. Something about that shit just turned yeah. me on. Like, <laughs> yo, Meg be talking that shit. Yo, I be listening to Meg. I Meg, like, yeah. Meg, I gonna, said this shit the other day. I got to that. that. Oh yeah, we gonna get on that. We gotta finish this list. Yeah, Born yeah. to Kill, Jeezy, Feature. It was Usual tough. shit. Both of them just it talking was, shit right. back and forth. It wasn't what I thought it was gonna be. Nah, this you is thought a, it was gonna be another war already. Like no, no. But I thought this is what I'm saying. I knew Jeezy won't go. They gonna have one on 104, and that's gonna be the one yeah, where niggas okay. got down. So that might be. And I think I think Ross might wash him up there. I, he is. 
<laughs> he is because Jeezy, Jeezy, Jeezy is going to try his best. Because being right. that that's his last album, Jeezy going to try his best. And Ross know what he got to do. Yeah. He know what he got to do. He got to flame his shit. Yeah. Fascinated. Track 10. That was a typical in the middle of Ross album songs. Yeah. And all Ross album, he had that song in the middle uh, like that just goes like yeah. you can hear him talking and you can hit a beat. The beat just dope. Yeah. I mean, he had the joint with the weekend on one of them shits. Yeah. I think it was Matt. Was it Mastermind? Mastermind? Yeah, it was Mastermind. Yeah, he had the joint with the weekend. Shit. That shit just floated. Like he got, he got those. So I felt like that's a sleeper, but I went and skip it. Yeah, I gotta go back. It, I really gotta go back and listen. Listen to, that one to Fascinated. Yeah, yeah. I still pray. I, 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 I fucked with it. He he I, had I it was he had bars. Shit. They were songs yeah. in real life. Like, yeah, he had bars just, on that one. That he excluded the rich nigga rap from yeah. that song. And yeah, they was just talking like, nigga, this is what life. I still yeah. like life. Yeah. You know what I'm saying? I gotta go back and listen to that one. I ain't gonna lie. It was go, it was it was that port of I think my, it, it was cause regular of the, port of Miami yeah. shit. Yeah, yeah. It I think it was because of the features and how he usually do with them type of features. Mm-hmm. The song don't really be my but even I it was really I kind of fuck with Lucci, but yeah, even like even Lucci, Lucci. verse it was yeah. just you put Lucci, you yeah. put Lucci yeah. on the hook that shit go right. Yeah. Well, I don't dislike either artist, but it's just like like yeah. we said last like trap trap trap. I don't like I don't yeah. dislike either artist that was up there, but on that song it was just it just it didn't feel yeah. Organic, it feel yeah, like they just, just did a song. I feel you though. Like I'm gonna put these, I'm gonna put these two niggas on this song. Yeah. Because he know the song go that. pop. Because he know the song go pop. Which <laughs> I can orchestrate that. Yeah. Which yeah, it did. So. so which is always good, man. It's always good because Ross, when he starts picking his features, which we got one song get to the end, they which know. I don't think he should have did, but. We, when he we, do his features, he know what he doing when he pick certain there. people. Because yeah. he got to do it. Car- Look, he said that shit a while back before this album even came out. He was like, I got a joint with Cardi B. It's the touch me, tease me. I took the beat and I flipped it. And I got a Cardi B on this shit. And yeah. I thought it was going to be on this album. And it won't. I know that shit so he got that shit in the still. And yeah. I was like, that shit is going to be crazy. I know that shit they might throw that shit on her album. They might. I mean, might. might throw that shit on her they album. Might, but he got a joint with her. I'm ready to hear that shit. Track 12, Running the Streets, A Boogie and Denzel Curry. I love Curry. this shit. I love, shit. I love this fucking yeah. song. I love this my fucking shit. song. This song and nobody's favorite, my two favorite yeah. songs on the album. A Boogie. I was never an A Boogie fan until his last album came yeah. out. Yeah, yeah. And I listened to his last album. I was, I was like, way. I was like, oh, this little weird nigga really do sound like Michael Jackson. <laughs> I was like, this is a hood nigga, this little hood nigga. But he got he got songs like he's a singing R and B nigga, like yeah. From from out there, yeah, yeah. and then I was like, all right, that's his shit, that's his way. So for Ross to put him on a hook, yeah. it's like you already know what this shit is about to take yeah. off to. And, uh, and that's what I said. I caught that shit because niggas ain't know if it was gonna be a verse from. I was like, yo, if, if he a just boogie stick, on it, if he yeah. just stick to the hook on that hook, shit, he body. He, he I just it. wish Mozzie yeah. was on that. And that was a Mozzie yeah. track, bro. Yeah, I don't even. Who was the last nigga? I don't even think they had his name on the goddamn shit. But it was a nigga that rapped that day. Denzel Curry. Oh, that's what it was. Yeah, that's okay. I like. I'm not. I, me personally, like, I hear him every now and then. But I don't know. Yeah, I don't know too much about the boy. Either. I ain't never listened to I the see boy. It, like I that. mean, I see his name here and there, but no. I don't, but niggas yeah, say yeah, he yeah. alright though. Yeah, yeah. So I'm gonna, I'm gonna check him out. We got to get into our young nigga bag. Look, this is what I need y'all to do. Oh, because we old, nigga. We all yeah, over 30. Yeah. So recommend some young rappers and actually give us the songs, the name for us to go check out and listen. So to. we can check these this, people yeah, out. We can check the people well, out. Since y'all want to do that, Ugly God just dropped the album this week. Oh. I heard, I but I heard. Ski mask and slump guy. Yeah, I don't know nothing yeah. about it. Yeah, <laughs> ugly guy. It's a terrible ugly name guy. <laughs> been out for a minute though. <laughs> ugly guy. I've heard ugly guy for a little minute now, but his. I don't be hearing his shit pop like that. Yeah. yeah. But so, but I, but that's another nigga I gotta check out. I'm telling you that Google Play Store, less music shit, whatever all that shit is. Yeah. I be turning that shit up. I be listening. I be finding albums and just listening. Yeah. And I was like, fucking, I'm paying this money. They better give me that. So shout out got, to Google, y'all do y'all thing. We got three songs left. So <laughs> shout it out, Google. Like yeah, Google yeah. need a shout out. <laughs> yeah, hey, look, look, I'm just saying, we appreciate y'all. We do, <laughs> for sure. Sponsor us. Uh, <laughs> <laughs> just put at least put the podcast at the top. Yeah, of the yeah, yeah, search yeah. podcast somewhere, somewhere up there. Be so, wild, be. You know, you can put us above Joe Rogan one time, even if all it's an accident. Them, all of them. Like uh, you can accidentally put <laughs> us above Joe Rogan one time, real for like. Four minutes. That's all niggas need. You want to be like an a, hour. You want to be above a white man in America for four minutes? So yeah, uh, track, 13. <laughs> track, <laughs> track thirteen, Vegas residency. Rick Ross talking big boy shit. Yeah. That was that was for Black Bo. It was. That was for Black Bo. 
Yeah. That was for Black Bolt. Yeah. And he yeah, talked this talk. Yeah, I thought Hove was going to be on there. I thought he was gonna be one uh, of the secret features. Oh, that was, that was tough. I thought who was. Nah, that would have been there. tough. Now nah, him on Vegas, but see Jay just on that. He not talking about Vegas, right? That nigga trying to own a guy. He want to own. That nigga want a whole country. That nigga is on salute the hove. Shout out hove. That cause. nigga is the weekly just, salute just to fucking cause. Yeah. You weren't even on the album, but you should have been. Yeah. <laughs> could, that would have been the only thing that Ross could have did better. That's it. That was yeah, but I it was it was it was dope. It was dope. It was for Black Bowl, so I, I just took it for what it was. Yeah, yeah. It's the next joint. Layback music. The, 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 the controversy. And then uh, six. The uh. controversy. The controversy. Okay. Layback music six with no push verse. How you feel about that? <laughs> How do I feel? I feel like that shit should have stayed up there. Pusha floated on that motherfucker. So that's how you feel. Pusha gave you real life bars on that on that, on that he verse. Floated but the on was, that. there were still some subliminals on the shit. And you could, listen, exactly. And you could put the exactly. subliminals in the song with Wayne or Ross. When yeah. he, did you hear his uh, Ross did his goddamn Hot Nine Seven joint? Right. I ain't watched the interview. I heard it was a dope man. Interview, the nigga gave he gave him the illest. Fake excuse ever of why he didn't put him up there. What'd he say? The nigga said, I just didn't feel like it was organic. I got both of them. He got both of their sides to clear it. Yeah. He just said he didn't feel organic. It didn't feel organic putting it out like that. He'd rather have both of them in the studio together type shit. That ain't gonna happen no Listen, time. listen. I said, I said, what kind of excuses this nigga push? You got a verse from push. You that's got a verse from Wayne. That's a boss shit. A classic push, verse push, from Push. Push verse was about to drown out all that shit. It was. But it, it was, was about subs in the, but, in the but, but Push it, ended his verse with your Miami rental cars Wayne, are sleeping in my garage. Yes. yes. Yeah. Wayne, Wayne yeah. verse, Come on. Wayne's verse wasn't good enough. Bro. It wasn't. It wasn't good enough. And Raw said, my verse is going to stick regardless. Yeah, but I can't. But I can't have you drown out Wayne. Yeah. Like, nah, I'm not going to let you do that. And I can't take Wayne off the track. I just yeah. watched what you did to Drake. I'm not about to let you do this to Wayne. Wayne, that's different. That nigga's You a know what it have been on? Remember that's the, the young buck John Stop. Yeah. Yeah, yeah I'm talking about that about, And they took him off yeah. and left him. So it'd be some yeah. shit like Cause that. Cause that ludicrous, that ludicrous. No, nah, I can't even say all that. So please, cause stay push the a push a verse, dick, like, push a verse on here was subtle, but then I'm still here, pow, like well, I'm a smacky. Yeah, that you know, you know that when you listen to the verse, that shit. ludicrous verse on stump was blatant. Is that he yeah, he like, came up there when I heard this motherfucker say, "Motherfucker, I'm a monster in this game," and I was <laughs> like, "Oh shit, this nigga Luda mad. He's mad. <laughs> that nigga is hot." And when he started, he said, maintaining my fish tank in your house costs the same. Yeah. Nigga, you don't know what type of money that is? Yeah, don't talk, is? don't talk. Don't, 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 like, that, that's crazy. In T.I. defense, if, if if it's defendable. The verse was done after nah. the fact. Yeah. Yeah. yeah, he heard T.I. Yeah. shit. He had time to it think about I it. Right. We, we, we all know T.I. doesn't need a defense. T.I. can nah. really rap. Yeah, yeah. And, and T.I. won't even dissing him on the verse. Like, you yeah. can't pick a, a name like Ludacris and be mad that nah, niggas use No, no, no. A lot of that, when he was talking at uh, Danaville, when they yeah, started yelling yeah, yeah, out, yeah. he was talking shit to him yeah, blatantly. Was. It was uh, like, nigga, I'm telling you, nigga, I'm talking to you. Me getting beat down? Because they had the whole beef. It was with Shaka Tip and Shaka Zulu got in the fight. Yeah. I was like, oh, no, nah, that's beef, so, nigga. Overall, let me say, I think maybe that music six would have been better with Push's verse on it. Definitely yeah. would have. Push it definitely had a, had a better verse than Wayne on it. But yeah. I, I, we, I'm we kind of you, I don't think this really, because of that fact, I really don't think this lived up to the standard of the first five. Nah. Yeah, I did. So that's my thing, because I, mean, I feel like ain't no point in us reviewing Gold Roses. Like, that shit been out for a minute. We, no, no, we, we can't. know, no, no we're we going to talk about it. You want to talk about Gold Roses? Let's do it. Let's do it. Because yeah. and, and, yeah. at the end but of the we, day. Because we reviewed it last it week. It doesn't matter. So it, does, do it. it doesn't let's matter. Do it. Why you would you put this? Yeah, I wasn't. And this is the dumbest shit. Aubrey Graham. When the song first came out and I heard the beat, I said, this sound like some 8 a.m. in Toronto shit or some some new shit. He got a. And when as soon as he came on that bitch, I was like, "Oh, here this nigga go." And I said he's gonna he snap. Yeah, I yeah. said he's gonna snap. He, he renegated Ross up there, but the hook was fire but, too. Though he renegated the, the him up was, there. At the end, when I was like, I was ready. I was like, "Oh, this Ross next shit. This shit gonna be on the album. I want to hear this." Man, when he came with that decent 
ass the verse. Decent verse. <laughs> I said, bro, this shit better not be on the album. It better nah, be like it, it better be like Free Spirit. Yeah. Like he not gonna put I'm him not, on the album. I'm not mad yeah. at a nigga out rapping you on your own song because that just means you pick the rhythm. No, rhythm that's feature. embarrassing. Not yeah. on that beat. J. Cole got rapped by out rapped by the baby on the dream. Oh yeah, he said, t- but yeah, no no no. He but him. he purposely did that, bro. Uh, yeah. I feel like he purposely yeah. did that. No, I think the baby just rapped how, his ass. How off. long has Cole been No 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 But you Listen, talking about a nigga Cole, who who last Cole verse was him saying how he body niggas on their yeah. own shit. But he how, when has he not said that? I mean, Anytime the, he done said like from Young Simba to all this other shit, like I'll kill all these niggas if I feel <laughs> like it. Which we seen this past because every feature before that, yeah. well, no, that was his feature yeah, for the Dreamville yeah. album. But any feature that Cole is on right now, he body is shit. He's yeah. killing all these niggas. Push so, it to though. But he let him do it from North Carolina. He let him go in this shit. But the pusher shit, pusher should have had that shit on there, but. That was Ross saving that nigga and Pusha know that. I think Pusha's verse would have saved it though in the line of Maybach music to me. So, oh yeah. But overall, you know what I'm saying? It was like 15 tracks. I think out of the 15 tracks, I fuck with 10 of them. Yeah. I fuck with more than 10. That's what I'm saying. And the ones that I don't fuck with, it's not it's, that I don't fuck not, with them. They're just iffy yeah, tracks. Yeah. Iffy tracks. It's one of them shit that just, <coughs> that shit might end up being like a favorite. I got, like I got back. So I gotta go back a couple months down the line. So. Shit. First of shit, you just pop in and play. Yeah. But like I said, it's this August shit is about to be. I go to four mics. If we were back in the source days, maybe four and a half. They had the. Uh, they didn't kept push up there. It'd have been four and a half. So I'm going to give it four. Gunplay's verse might have said it because that uh, verse I'm, is just I'm five. Gonna him, yeah. I'm going to give him four and a half. I'll give him four and a half out of five. I would give him one. If he'd have kept pushing and put Hove up there, it would have been five. If he would have put Hove up yeah. If he would have put <laughs> Hove up there, five. it would have been five. Bro. It definitely would have been five. Doesn't matter. It's, it's gonna ride, of, I just thought about ride a lot of albums. It's a lot of albums that came out. That little dirt shit came out. Yeah, I ain't get to hear it yet. I seen that Man, shit. Man, uh, that boy know he going to jail. That no, no, he know it's over. He rap, that nigga that's how he is rapping, rapping, rapping his ass. He go back yeah. to three hundred dirt. Like he go, he goes back and he is snapping. Yeah. Yeah. And he still got his love songs like on his a boogie shit up there. Like yeah. that album was definitely that uh love songs for the streets too. Yeah, yeah, that shit is crazy. Um, BJ the Chicago kid dropped. That, that shit. shit. That shit fire. That's what. That's that what some R and B. That's some R. That's crazy. some good R and B. No, I ain't heard that shit. Oh yeah, yeah you man, gotta go, hear go that. You that. got it. That shit. That shit fire. I can believe that. He that got it. He got fire. a lot of. He got a lot of cool. He remind me of like a a trill goddamn music soul child when that yeah. nigga get in there and start singing. Damn yeah. right. I be like, yo, dude, dope. Uh, Boz, I don't know if y'all fuck with Boz from Dreamville. That spilled milk it, joint. Yeah, he that had. shit. That shit. I, I didn't even. Li- I ain't right. listen to it yet, but I know I fuck with him. His bars is. Yeah. He definitely got bars. Yeah, I fuck with him. Who else? It was Ross or nothing for me this weekend, B. <laughs> no, who else? It's somebody else that dropped recently. Um, I'm trying to think. Oh, why be in Corday? Mm. The young that boy. That shit is. Fire. And that little that's motherfucker, that shit I keep fire. hearing this fire. rapping. That up there. album is fire. He rapping up there. I keep hearing mm-hmm. that shit hard. Yeah. Out of all the, the the young niggas, he got bars. He the one right there. Yeah, he the one that got bars. Bar wise, man, that baby, the baby fire. No, but yeah. he said the way he said it, he said like I'm really not into caring about uh, like what people my album sales is he was like did y'all hear how people was reviewing yeah. my album he yeah. said the streets love my the shit like i don't care about the record and i was sitting there like and i'm the, still gonna do shows and he's doing money. it right yeah because he's a young nigga wanna... that's paying homage and and he really motherfucking do his research when they come mm-hmm. to this rap shit you know what i'm saying so you know who they said was talking him and andre 3000 i said if them niggas do a track together that shit is gonna be, be stupid because his um his funk flex freestyle, that shit, was, shit was fire. That shit was crazy. I, they, was when I didn't, I, I never no, listened to it. No, not funk flex. It was sway. It was sway. I think it was sway shit. Niggas be taking the same freestyle and doing them. Of course. Shit. Of course they do. They be doing the same shit. But that, his album, he's definitely going to be somebody I'm looking forward to hearing more music from. Because he, boy's dope. Yeah. Um, music. Oh, Snoop. Did y'all hear the "Let By Guns Be By Guns"? Yeah, shit, man. Nah. Nah, I, I listen. Been slack. Where I fuck listen I've been to this week? I listen to it. I sent it in. I, f- I forgot. You, you can't it. text this nigga. Shit. <laughs> nah, this you know, nigga you know this is this nigga. Just, I'm the, the worst, worst nigga I ever. The worst <laughs> nigga on earth to text. text. Like. Text and I don't even, I terrible. swear to God, I don't be doing shit. Like, I look said, at the when phone. When you gonna text this man? I don't know. He see it, he see it. But he did send the shit. But the shit is dope. He, Snoop, let it all out. 
Like he got it all, and he got everything he wanted to get all out. Pretty much he said, said, "Hey, nigga, I can't hate Suge. He changed my fucking life." That nigga told him, "That's my nigga." You? He said, yeah. "He said Suge is my nigga. I don't know. Yeah, he did fuck shit, and I mean, yeah. but he took care of us when goddamn nobody would. Yeah, goddamn, it wouldn't be no like Snoop Dogg if, if, if it wasn't for Suge. Yeah, yeah. He for pretty sure. much was like, nigga, Suge. Part of the reason why Bloods and Crips can he said we game banging in New York. He said, yeah, he said on the stage in New York. Yeah, Snoop on the talked stage this in shit. New York. He talked this shit on that. Track. It was real though. Yeah, Snoop talked this shit up there. Already like, the Source Awards, nigga. That's how oh, y'all ain't it. got love. Y'all ain't got love for Drake. That nigga Snoop said, nah, I couldn't have no conversation with him. I had to go have a sit down. Yeah, yeah he had to go have a sit down. I had to go look that man That's in my his man. Eyes. Yeah. yeah. Like, I don't give a fuck what y'all talking about. What y'all yeah. think about niggas, this nigga? Niggas, y'all was on trial. Niggas, yeah. niggas was on trial. Yeah. Niggas was on trial. Niggas even was even if we beefing, that's my nigga. That's my nigga. You know what I'm saying? Like, yeah. yeah. And I'll go holler at him about this shit. That was definitely, that was definitely a dope track. But, I mean, I wouldn't expect nothing less from a nigga like Snoop, though, man. It's, Snoop been wilding lately, Snoop though. Snoop is like... Snoop been doing that gospel album. I'm sorry, I'm not, I won't. No, I won't feel it. I won't with that. Look, it's it. the number. It, that shit was number one because, for like because people want to like hear Snoop Dogg. That was that. He did he's that to do that Snoop shit, bro. Snoop. Hey, yeah, yeah, I mean, of course. He's that type of. He's that type of artist. That really that, that going to buy. That want to look at that shit too. And he knew that. He knew exactly. He, he knew that it. niggas was gonna go listen just because yeah. it's a Snoop, just like DMX. All the fraudulent all the fraudulent niggas in church came out. The whole. This nigga caught the weed check. listening to the Snoop this album. This nigga Snoop went and got a check right fast. He said, From the church, we see Kurt Franklin do it. Fuck it, nigga. And That's so now I was. feel like now TV I feel like he back. Like now I feel like he back yeah. to doing this music shit because he's seeing where this music shit is going. No, because he, he did the reggae shit first. Changed yep. the name to Snoop Lion. Yep. Did that. Yep. He was bored. <laughs> man, 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 That's what happens when you're 50 and you at the crib bored. You can still just do the fuck you want to do. And can't nobody beat you in mad. You just. Running through niggas in Madden. I'm nice. Like, I don't even got no competition. Let me just go. <laughs> come see me in Madden, nigga. I'm yeah, super nice. Look, that nigga, he, look, he demolished that nigga and put his shit on the goddamn yeah, YouTube. <laughs> like, look at this bum ass nigga. He no. can't play. I said, oh, that that's shit, bad. he beat the nigga like 72 to like 12. Yeah, he fucked him up. <laughs> Like, won't no 21 rule, nigga. Know, we niggas gonna run this bitch. You know niggas don't be posting their real shit, though, when they get their ass. When they, get ass, yeah, when they don't nah. post none of those. But, nah, like, you but can't, that's, you can't that's what happened, though. The nigga, he beat Snoop by like three points yeah. and was talking cash ass. shit yeah, and the nigga came Snoop back. beat that nigga by like 50. they went in practice you still gotta see you one more time yeah, the hey, look, hey, exactly, <laughs> exactly. Yeah. snoop popped a lot of shit but shout out to snoop too man. Yeah. you're a legend you're a legend we probably not gonna get one before the end of the year yeah <laughs> the album that i really need to hear especially after this past week yo i need a new joe budden album He's Budden ain't dropping shit. He ain't Joe, dropping no Nigga, Joe Budden that. this past week was rated the number three rapper of but, all time. Hey, let's get now, into that, it. That, <laughs> let's get into it. That, I saw the top 50 list. That's it. What did shit say? Jay-Z. Let's get into it. Nas. Nas Joe, Joe Budden. Budden. He's the third best rapper of all time. I need a Joe Budden now. Let's let's get into hey, it. Joe Budden now. Let me yeah. find this motherfucker. That shit is going to be bad. Cause that's we definitely gotta we definitely gotta uh go ahead and, and cause get i this. don't think bro it's different it's different now man it's Nigga, just it's, no it's, it's not different <laughs> it's, it's just it doesn't different. matter what universe you're in joe but is not the third no best no it's just time. different no i'm just saying it's different <coughs> for joe like i'm talking about joe like why would you put joe and i'm gonna put somebody the, who i'm gonna make sure nigga. i put the list up Somebody yeah. on, on the screen yeah. so niggas can somebody see what the fuck is going knew, on. Somebody knew Joe Budden to make this goddamn list. Somebody Joe Budden made the fucking list. That's who made the fucking list. I said, this nigga goddamn. Hey, man, Joe, Joe said he Budden didn't make that shit. Joe, Joe Budden and Rory sat in the room and made the fucking list. They had <laughs> that shit the fuck. Yeah, because Ma ain't had shit to do with that. And Ma, then you better not have condone that fuck shit. <laughs> and, that, and that nigga, listen, and the nigga... <laughs> the nigga was snapping. Not that fuck shit, Ma. The nigga was snapping like, like nigga... I thought they were my friends. <laughs> I thought they were my friends, but I guess not. Like, nigga, you know good as damn well. Nigga, don't take me wrong. Joe Budden, I really believe Joe Budden yeah. can rap. No, he, he can rap. He, he absolutely that. belongs on the list. Look aside, at how wild aside, that from, list aside from Pump It Up, Joe, like. Look at how wild that list was, though. But look, when I oh, say this, was some nice drop you know what I'm about man. to say, right? They had beans over Rock Him. I mean, no, no, they had beans over right Salute here. to Philly. Yeah, hey, look, it's it's definitely, definitely, I was going to say, you telling the wrong nigga that hey, look, that's what I said. Right yeah, hey, look, that's what I was like, bro. I give you the reason why I'm the truth for real. But I'm sitting there like, I'm thinking in my head, I'm like, 
this nigga Beans, I know this nigga Beans is nasty as a motherfucker, but it's Rock Kim. But then I keep thinking like, yo, this Beans nigga Beans. Beans with one lung is still rapping. Yeah, yeah like, I said, this nigga yeah. Beans is just still just, oh. Uh, it's an animal. Beans, Beans is an animal, man. No, but, I kicked the nigga but hold on, the I'm, 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 I'm going to ask some controversial this. shit. I'm about to sing Kiss Like a Are you putting Rakim? Rock Kim? Over beans because of his legendary status, or because you really feel like that's he's the only reason. No, I, or I look at it like, like he's a better MC. I look at beans. it. I look at it like this. No, not today. I'm not doing today. No, no, I'm not just today. Saying, I'm just talking about I'm like talking body about, of work type shit. For me, it's like this. It's like you have that legendary status. Why? Yeah, I mean, because you, you inspire. Yeah, yeah, you yeah. inspire yeah. niggas like Nas to rap. Yeah, don't get me you wrong. Inspire, you inspire. Hey, don't get me wrong. I'm, you, I'm not asking that. Like I. Yeah. yeah, but when you go when you when you go to break him yeah. down, when you go to break it down, his rhyme scheme, his patterns, yeah. like it's been a long. Hey, look, like when when they start doing that, and then you look at us now, and you hear us rapping, like you can hear it in our shit. So I was like, for a nigga just to be able to have pretty much started that shit for real, and fuck that shit up. Yeah, like right. nigga, like you are solidified as one of the top niggas, point blank, period. As I look at this list, it was a bunch of wild shit on this list, though. That's why I said, look at all the. I'm talking about the the Rock him and, and Nigga, they had Red right Man before week. Pac. They had Pac. They had a <laughs> lot of shit. Shout out to Red though, man. Shout out to Jersey. I fuck yeah, with Jersey. Yeah, I fuck with him, but but no, like, no. but no, but out there, nigga, Red Man is the illest nigga. Like they will tell you, Red. They man got is eight the ball from nigga. eight ball and MJG before Big Pun. That pun shit was disrespectful as fuck. Like pun at, I'm, pun I'm at 44. That that, I agree yeah. with that shit. Like a mother. That yeah, pun shit was man. disrespectful as fuck. And ain't no big, got, no, ain't no, no big, big L. L. Yeah, no I was big about to L. say no big they L. Shit L even be on this list. Yeah, it's a lot of niggas. It's a lot of niggas. Hey, that I'm gonna say just I looking mean, at nigga looking at Ross at 47. That's bullshit. <laughs> Ross is top five. That's crazy. They got so, that's crazy. They. I yeah, want to know, I want to know crazy. the people, all our viewers, I need y'all to drop your top five of all time. Oh, yeah. Who, who are you thinking? Oh, we can even do a top ten. Because top five be. Yeah, give me top ten if you want we'll to. We'll do top ten. We two, top five, top ten. Don't drop your top 50 because we probably not going to nah. read that shit. I'm, no, I no, might no. read it. No, trash and shit. <laughs> <laughs> I got time. Like, how, can you, how can you pull 50? Like, yeah, I'm not saying I don't see how motherfuckers yeah. couldn't even pull 50. Give me your yeah. top five, top ten of all time. We can debate this list. In no specific yeah. order, mine consists of Jay Z, Lil Wayne, and me? Tupac, Ross, yeah. and I want to put the lot. I gotta, I gotta put old, I gotta right. put old niggas back in there too, though. It's like yeah. it's a lot of niggas got there. But you got everybody. Most of the people I name have been rapping since '95, '98. Yeah, these like, are our people. That's what I said. Yeah. These are our but people. Yeah, these so are niggas cannabis. We was niggas, gonna, niggas forget about. Yeah, see, right. we was niggas gonna do this shit. Certain niggas. We was gonna do this last episode. We wanted to wait because okay. we knew we had the. We wanted just that third opinion here. Okay. But quiet as kept when the camera start start rolling. We was like, yo, who like your favorite rap group? This nigga gonna say Smiles and South Star. Like out of like out of. do that? Smiles and South Star was fire as fuck. In no lifetime whatsoever. You tripping. Them boys are trash. Trash. Them Super boys are trash. <laughs> them boys are trash. You really believe I would say some shit like no, that? No, I was yes. about to say, I had to look at you for a second just to make sure. Because I was about to say, because niggas be coming up with some wild answers these days, obviously by this list of who they think are good. Yeah. And so this shit is. There's no way that you can look in the mirror and say Joe Button is the third best <laughs> of all time and not laugh. Exactly. That and not laugh, wild. yo. It's impossible. That shit is But to keep it 100, though, not saying that he should be number three or nothing, but I would say what percentage of this list think that you think he can't outrap right now? Right now. I mean, if you're talking about this president. Oh, that he oh. can't out, outrap? It's a lot of them. There's a lot of them currently. There's a lot of them. <laughs> He's not out rapping Jay Z currently. No, of course, I mean, nah, that's what I'm saying. That's why I say Styles. I would say he's he not out rapping Kendrick. Nah, nah. He's not out rapping Push. And, and niggas might niggas might scold me for this, but looking just looking at this list, he might not right out rap Ti. Right now, he could probably out rap eighty five to ninety percent of this game list. Up, yeah, game up here. Yeah, he can't. He definitely can't out rap the game. I say he can he can probably out rap eighty five to ninety percent of this list. Nah, that's why that, that I, game beef and shit they they got that shit about the pop. 70% of the list? No, right? I'm talking about right now. Yeah, I'm, I'm talking about Smooth 60. Because Black yeah. Thought's been on fire. He's yeah. not out rapping yeah. Kiss. Fabulous is going to yeah. give him a run for his money. He's not out rapping Kendrick. He's not out rapping Push. The 
J. Cole gonna give him a run for his money. That's why I said Drake gonna give him a run for his money. T.I. gonna give him a run for his money. I'm not even halfway through the list. Though. Hey, like, like, it's, you just naming niggas that yeah, dust that nigga just, that could possibly that could possibly that, that are gonna yeah. give this nigga a real life run for his money. I mean, Don't get me wrong, joking. I rap. mean, the Drake shit is already yeah. solidified. Yeah. He did that. Like that shit was just was yeah. Drake ain't even want to respond. No. Joe, Joe go toe. I give you that. Joe go toe for toe with a lot of these niggas. Yeah, yeah. it'll be a real lyrical, ba- uh, lyrical Joe, warfare. We don't think. And he Joe gonna is, drop like ninety fucking. We don't songs think Joe is trash. Year. We just know for damn sure Joe ain't fucking third. The third best. Song. Yeah, 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 nah, 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 not the third. I like I to mean, play devil's advocate with shit. Die line, die line, die line, die line. Yeah. Die line I seen a list yeah. like that. I it was just die line fifty times in that motherfucker. I just don't get it. Whoever when Joe, I was about to say whoever made it, but that makes sense that Joe Bud made that damn man. Yeah. All right, shit. What other music news we got? Um, that slimy two. I mean, super slimy two. Uh, Young Thug, Gunna, Little Baby, and Future. Is that a song? Yeah, no, a song. it's a it's a it's a album coming out or a mixtape album mixtape coming out. That's, that's, that's gonna be dope. And that's gonna be dope coming though. out like, like within the next like one or two. Like, I was like that until I heard the Gunna and Baby shit. And when I heard that Gunna and Baby fucking uh, Lil Baby. Yeah, yeah. Yeah, when they shit came out with the close friends, that niggas was goddamn yeah, riding yeah. around with the chain bump. Yeah, that's I it. said, that shit go That shit was fire. Yeah, that makes yeah, it was dope. And so they, they but I all think four of them niggas on one album? And you so said the, Thug, Future. Thug, Future, Lil Baby, and uh, Gunna. That's every, everybody. They gonna, they gonna tag team that shit. Yeah. And I'm telling you, and all of them, all of them probably work good with each other. Yeah. Cause I don't think it's gonna be all four of them on every fucking no, song. No, you no. Know but that's that's gonna be if it's it's super slimy too, too. Yeah. So Number this one, is exactly what this is for. This is meant for that. It's like a compilation album yeah. for all of them. I mean, how many features did the Thug do that won't fire? Like nah. feature do um, Thug do that? That shit he did on Swiss yeah. Beats album was crazy. That yeah. Twenty Five Soldier shit. That yeah, nigga flame that shit. Thug, that thug nigga flame that shit. shit. Do that shit. Well, who else got? Oh, oh, so now that we still talking about the music, like I said, Jeezy dropping two weeks. Okay, Jeezy last couple hours was a suspect to me, man. So I can't, I can't wait to come back. So I need I needed to be and, supplied. And I can't wait to come back and put motherfucking Port of Miami too and Thug that Motivation. I believe that team. I want to put uh, neck and neck. I can't wait. He going back. He going back to 808 Mafia. He going back to all of them. Gonna he see. going to Lex. He going to Lex. This nigga's going back to TM 101, dog. I'm telling you. Except a couple of the joints, like I said, like the Ross type shit. Yeah. He going to have dope, but yeah. on his Ross joint, that's what I told you. That joint he got with Ross for his album, that nigga going to be, Jeezy going to be talking some fuck. Because Gucci done already solidified it with his album that he just dropped. And that shit fire. And the, the first that track, that nigga said, that beef ain't never pussy to somebody die. Nah, yeah. Like somebody got to die. I said, you know what, Jeezy? It ain't time to be political no more, though. Nah, like, man, and, and that beef should never be over. No, nah. certain beefs I think they gonna like him and them two and Fifty and jo- like that shit just never. The Wayne, I don't bro. think the Wayne and Pusha shit should ever be over. For what? Because because you got the well, young see, nigga to jump in the shit. But they shit, they shit or? could get squashed only because that shit never came to anything. After, after you do Exodus, though, you cannot fix nothing. Nah, but you can just I'm end sorry. the beef fight. Because that never, yeah, nobody though, died of Nobody, that fight, yeah. nobody even got touched. Arm. Nobody got in no fights or nothing. Like, Bro, dude, that nigga, Jeezy, man, that died. nigga got there. And then Gucci <laughs> on the track told this nigga to dig his dead homie up. Yeah. I bet he can't say shit. shit. No, I mean, that's, that's of course, that's solidified. That's not going nowhere. I, at that point, that nigga, if, Jay-Z, still doesn't let Nas drop on a day <laughs> by himself. The nigga, Beyonce dropped the Lion King album when Lost Tapes 2 came out. That's why niggas ain't really know this shit was dropping. <laughs> Bruh, the nigga is You're an instigating a, ass so, nigga, Some bro. beef just don't get fixed like that and, and a nigga might not die. That's J Mans now. You an instigating ass nigga. Man, that nigga don't never go look it, look it up. That nigga, every, every year when that nigga try to drop, this nigga drop some shit. First him and, him and Beyonce one. dropped the shit last year. I'm telling y'all, man. That shit ain't never over. You drop some shit like Ether on me, nigga. This shit is forever. This shit is forever. Nah, Fuck super, you, super ugly. Was super ugly saying, wasn't even all that. It was. It was. It was more disrespectful. It was hurt. It was just hurtful. Yeah, it was, was hurtful, was, Jay. Uh, and we don't like seeing hurtful Jay. We like seeing Jay with the ball. Spiteful. Yeah. But I mean, hey. I mean, even shit. taking even taking um, super ugly out, I don't think Ether was better than Blueprint Two. But man, I mean, Blueprint Two was a whole album. Yeah. No, the song Blueprint Two. There was a song called Blueprint Two. 
Oh, at the beginning of the yeah, yeah, uh, I got beginning. my mojo oh, yeah, back, yeah, yeah, yeah. baby. Oh, behave. But see, no, nah, that it won't. But ether was different. Ether was different. No, I mean was, this. This is an argument that I never end though. Yeah. Because. But that's how, that's how I like my beef, though. Over, though. That's how I like my beef. I like my beef. <laughs> I like that shit. Like but that. even with TakeOver, TakeOver was one verse. Man, I like and the made, niggas uh, disrespect. And made the impact. Me. I'm sorry, a verse in a bar. Why you think Why you think Pusha did? If you go listen to story of Adion, he went back and got a whole beat. It was, it was, this shit is be planned out with this, when niggas was like, I'm going to demolish a nigga. Yeah. And when niggas get in that mode, like, bro, this is deeper than that Jay-Z, that wanks the shit killed Ja Rule. That wanks the shit killed Ja Rule career. Ja, ja Rule and then went and stabbed this nigga 50 up in the studio, cuz that's, that's real really shit. Good. Like, Murder Inc. was a good record label. Yeah, it was. And then yeah. and 50 just came in there and fucked that shit up, cuz I don't like y'all niggas. He is the bully. He is the bully of all bullies. Shout out to 50, though, oh, man. He's still, funny as well. Right. 50's one of the top five funniest Bruh, niggas that on nigga is fucking media. hilarious, Yo, bro. I pray to be that level of petty one day. No, I know I'm a petty nigga. Like, that nigga. 50 and Boosie is my two though? favorite social media motherfucking uh, people right now. Speaking, of, speaking oh. of Boosie, let's talk about this motherfucking pool party. Oh, that top everybody, pool party? What? That the trouble, trouble, oh, yeah. the trouble, trouble no, shit. That trouble shit. pool party. That was fucking If you crazy. listen, if you've been listening, like, That's I've been it. listening to this nigga Trouble Music. Yeah. But, like, if yeah. you listen to his music and you you know, like, the type nigga he is, like, that when he got fit. out of prison, when he got out of prison, he said, fuck that shit. I'm about to do this music shit and turn this shit up. That nigga dropped Edgewood and a whole bunch of other shit. And then he dropped the joint with goddamn Drake. And when he dropped that shit with Drake, it was like, all right, this nigga ain't playing. Yo. <laughs> My that nigga finally got on the radio. That she a winner. I looked at country in the car, nigga. We riding. Shout I told out to this cucumbers. Man. Oh yeah, they was doing that shit. They was I going said, look crazy. at this shit. I'm looking at. I'm like, man. Oh, IG live. This is wild. I was man. sitting there in the car, like, look at this shit. These, they out here wilding. I said it, man. It's sad that cucumbers are having a better summer than I am. It's some <laughs> bullshit. That pool party yesterday almost could have got like that, the way that shit I told was Giovanni, if I was coming to the pool party, I was bringing cucumbers. The nigga told me he was going to have security escort me out. Oh, yeah. <laughs> yeah, the security was. I was, was going to buy up all the fresh produce, nigga. Nah, security was tight, but goddamn. If you was in there, you was in there having a look, good ass if you know, if you, you want to look, if you want to take this shit to the next level, right? <laughs> He's right? Fuck doing eggplant. cucumbers. Have him deep throat actual eggplants. Yeah. Like, if oh, you get bitches to deep throat actual eggplants, this shit is lit. When you want to get married? <laughs> when you want to get married? Them bitches gotta have like a cartoon. <laughs> That's some cartoon Ooh. throat shit. Like you gotta take that shit next level. You boy. know how like Scooby and just eat a whole fucking pe- like that's some them tonsils. Like you guys eat the tonsils. I don't know. Like. Yo, that's wild. But that pool party was that was wild. Control. That trouble. That trouble shit. That trouble shit was wild as a bitch. Like yeah, watching what it. Do, man. Uh, Black youngster like. had a that stripper party that he had on IG Live. Yeah, that's that's what what then he had a boxing ring in the middle of the ring. Yeah. No. Man, like, niggas, like, niggas with money, that's, man. That's Black Youngster M.O. anyway. You just know if that nigga throw a party. It's like, about to be some wild shit happening. You know Bruh, that them nigga cabanas, go do some crazy Them cabanas shit. was starting off at three racks. Gotcha, like, I, I'm like, <laughs> niggas got together and paid them got their three racks. Yeah, right. Yeah. Yeah. No, because so one thing people, about it, niggas had a ball. Everybody got their five? Cool. Niggas had a ball in that Think about it, man. If you go to any type of situation like that, if you in something like a cabana or a VIP section, yeah, like good. you automatically a magnet. Nigga, you ain't good. gotta be nobody important. You yeah. automatically a magnet. I'm they sure. coming. How does it feel like to spend money on VIP and not for something? I'm broke, so I've That's, never spent money on VIP. No, oh, I'm good. This nigga, this VIP poppy over here. Niggas do that. Niggas <laughs> just spending money on VIP and, and not and not getting no life. pussy. No, I don't know. You gotta look at. I don't know. <laughs> And the names uh, are not spoke to protect the innocent, <laughs> but it's some niggas out there that's like that. You see, I said niggas. Yeah, I'm yeah, not, yeah, I'm I, not I, speaking I, for me. I, I don't. Do niggas do that? I, I be there in general population most <laughs> yeah. of the time when I go. I'm going to get my drink and I be yeah, chilling. I'm I'm chilling I be enjoying yeah. myself. Oh, man. Those the big money niggas. But so there was three racks, man. Yeah, shit. That's it for, uh, no, that is not it for music. Hot Girl Summer. Ty Dolla Sign, remix. Ty My nigga Ty Dolla Sign beating that cocaine case. He need all the money he can get, bro. Right. And he yeah. definitely showed it on this one. I didn't hear the song yet, but I know it's going to be fire. All no, of a sudden, he started the it's first trash. off. No, Real ass trash. nigga give a fuck. <laughs> hey, give man. a fuck about these it bitches. It was trash. That's how he started it off? It was trash. 
Bro, it was trash. Nah, bro. I'm saying. It was it could, Meg could have gone without this shit, but I know yeah. she doing her shit with Nicki right now, so that shit pop. Yeah, they look but good. It, 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 was nobody's song, verse good? Meg's verse sounded Meg's verse, rushed. Meg verse sounded like a Meg verse. A, a Meg yeah, verse, yeah. It was like yeah. a typical Meg verse, but it sounded like she rushed. That it. way she be talking on that song with Nicki her verse sounded baby. like a Nicki her, verse. Her, her, a Nicki yeah. verse like yeah. on one of her like a B side Nicki verse. Oh. Yeah. yeah, it wasn't it wasn't yeah. nothing. To yeah, scream it, about it was it was like no, no, no. It, no but like it this could have not been a people single. people was mad at Meg I was like bro Meg has been lighting shit the fuck yeah, on fire yeah. like her boss did you see her cipher shit that she yeah she, like, she bodied that shit and I'm like yo shorty can really rap and I told niggas this the other day I said she remind me of Mia X bro that's who she remind me of like she a jank that can spit her ass off bro. She definitely looks better than me, X, though. I mean, I'm talking about bars, nigga. Yeah. No, I'm talking about bars, nigga. I love me the extra death. Meg like the Stallion needs like make me want to pray to her at night. That bitch. Meg the Stallion needs me want to pray to her at night. Yeah, I never mind. A nigga I, can't I, I get love, his dick. I was about to say something mad, a, vulgar. A, a, a nigga, a nigga I can't get his dick. That black queen. <laughs> <laughs> what you was going to say? Me and X look like you? I had nothing to say about me, X. I wouldn't even comment about that. I was thinking about Meg the Stallion and her knees. Oh, oh yeah, I ain't gonna. Yeah, yeah. I ain't gonna disrespect yeah. that black queen like that. No disrespect to me, X. Cause she really but the way she be talking on that song with the baby. Nigga, what you mean? Like we watched it on Instagram. Yeah. Like we watched her. How hurt? Man, keep doing what you're doing, Meg. That's all I'm please saying. Keep, I love you. Please I appreciate keep doing you. what you're doing. Yes. And keep yes. them bars for all of us. Keep all keep those it. bars going. Like shit, cause Lord, they need it. Cause outside of Cardi. She getting reckless, except for yeah. Rhapsody. I'm so disrespectful, except for Rhapsody, yeah. the queen, and she got to join the product. She, she don't, she don't get her Snow. just, she don't yeah. get her fucking just do. I don't see too many like, outside of Rhapsody, Remy, and Snow, the product. I don't see none of no woman in fucking the industry fucking with any of them. Yeah, not lyrically, no sir. Nah, they. I feel like they would demolish any woman rapper. But shout out to all them doing their thing. So yeah. outside of music, I only got one like news related shit, man. Kyle Uncle Epstein oh, yeah. apparently committed suicide. They got him to fuck about it. <laughs> <laughs> apparently committed suicide. That's you big money the, shit. Well, you <laughs> That's to, big money. Kyle Owens, you're about to snitch on rich white people. Mm -hmm. They will kill you. <laughs> Don't get it fucked up. That's, that's big money shit. You about to snitch on people in power? These uh, niggas will get you. You know. Do you know how here. sly you gotta oh. be to, to actually commit suicide on suicide watch? Bruh. They said they took him off suicide watch, but nobody can explain why they took him off suicide watch. Because he was. Because <laughs> he was about to won't no okay. point. <laughs> we know why you took him off suicide watch. <laughs> Cause they paid you to take them off. Yeah, as soon as they can get, as soon as they can get to your ass, where they take yeah. the fucking camera yeah. off, or they tell that nigga, hey. Bro, we're going to take care of your family for the rest of their life. We're going to take care of your family for the rest of your life. That guard going to be like, fuck this nigga. Hey, hey look, go ahead. Do your thing. Do you no, you talking about you millionaires. Me, you want me to kill him? Yeah. I kill him for you. How much y'all paying? For a fact. Suicide. So, it's niggas in there that do it for five racks. Yeah, you know, I'm talking you talking about billionaire money. Like, nigga, they talking about professional about hits. All I'm about to tell them these people. What the hell? You seen snitches that. get stitches. It don't matter if you in the black. I seen how they yeah. white that Russian politician. No, oh, these is motherfuckers that's that making judges and shit disappear. Yeah, like judges. Come on, man. You that think nigga in Russia, that nigga they slumped that nigga in the middle of the street. <laughs> I mean, drop. I mean, niggas pulled up and shot that nigga. Yeah. Care. Like what the fuck? Like y'all niggas, why? Y'all white people, white people will kill you. Yeah, they don't white give a fuck. Kill you. Kill you. <laughs> white people will kill you. <laughs> But uh yeah. yeah, what else we got with um oh up. I, don't uh, know. I was about to say shout out to all them people in El Paso and shit like that. Yeah, we did do that. Yeah, yeah. 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 I, I gotta did. I gotta say that y'all going through some shit, but uh definitely yeah, keep y'all heads up. Girl, yeah, all just, them people. Yeah. yeah shit crazy, crazy, man. That, as soon as uh, you say white people will kill you, I was like, nigga, I know, I live it. <laughs> white people are trying to yeah. kill you out here. Bro. Especially white people that look like McLovin. Yeah. <laughs> Stop right. disrespecting McLovin. Yo. Yeah, I'm, so I'm, not, I'm not with the shit, yo. <laughs> I'm sorry. Every white nigga that look like Harry Potter will kill you. Is that better? Oh, All right, damn. I'm cool with that. <laughs> All you the Harry Potter looking white boys. If you're white, you're Ben Affleck. That's what I'm saying, McLovin. dog. Like, 
niggas that look like white, that, that's white, that look like Harry Potter, every time they walk in something now, I'm on, I'm on edge. I got, I got a couple of We love homeless. white people, by the way. It's just we don't like racist white people. Yeah, I just don't like racist white people that kill people I for no reason. I got a couple reason. of homeboys that's white. That's cool. They, they some that, that's, the racist, <laughs> they, that's the most racist. That's the most racist shit. Oh, my best friend is white. No, like, that's no. what all racist white people say. Oh, I'm not racist. My best friend is black. That's cool. Jerry for white bitches for reparations. And fun. <laughs> no, reparations and recreation. And I love you all. <laughs> I love you all. Reparations and recreation. Women. Don't ever get it twisted. I love all of them. But all yeah. Them. I don't care if you uh, Y'all catch that meat shit on, on Amazon? I ain't catch it yet. I ain't catch it yet. They dropped it. I know, I know you, you watched it as soon as it came out and it's said, like, the minute it dropped, you hit play. So, it what's up, man? Let me <laughs> it was a five <laughs> episode documentary. So, you gonna let a nigga get the Amazon password, man? Because I can't afford Netflix that ain't like. I broke, baby. We broke, baby. Let niggas get that. Nigga, I have Network. a bootleg fire stick, just like you do. Speaking of which, if y'all need fire stick shit done, I'm your man. I can take care of that for you. Upgrade, you tired of cable power Self- about to come back on. Self <laughs> yes. <laughs> no, but, <laughs> but the, but the, the nigga power about bro. to come back on. The all nigga your leaned shows. forward like he was promoting. You, the nigga had the commercial to, ready. Yeah. Like, you got to. That you nigga was like, yeah, but you got uh, to. Listen, I'm I can get that for you. My tag information will be in the description. Make sure you like, make sure you subscribe. We is not putting, <laughs> we not putting this nigga <laughs> name on the bottom of the screen like <laughs> My name. We not put tagging it this nigga That's on said, Instagram. Put it, put it, just put it. Nah, just put it in the description. <laughs> don't, don't put it on the main shit. Put it in the description. We about to block this nigga out. We gonna edit the <laughs> shit out of this. We, t- oh, we. we about to push a T this nigga. Yeah. <laughs> he's, that shit was, um, he's off of this. That shit yeah. was dope, yo. It took you through his whole case. They really caught bull up in some bullshit. Yeah, and look, and they knew it. He knew it. And Rick Ross said it in that interview. He yeah, said really Meek just caught. didn't have the money yeah, to fight really it. Up he said it was bullshit, but he just didn't have the money to fight it. And that, and I'm, I was one of those people that could just put him in that predicament. They say he pulled a gun on the cops and aimed it at him. And, and they say the yeah. cop was dirty. I heard yeah, the, cop, the, the cop, cop was dirty. dirty. This shit was wild. I mean, you can tell, man. Look at how the judge was doing them. Like, you could tell, like, it was a vendetta against this nigga. But just think of how many one. people doing that shit. No, like, you know man. what? The first time she locked him up, I can understand it because realistically, the nigga got caught with a pistol. Mm-hmm. But he I'm did t- like he did like eleven yeah. months first time, and I can understand the judge being like, you know, what I'm saying, I'm trying to help you out, get your life together. <laughs> that shit could be understandable, but that shit that he went through after that, they the whole case was some bullshit. Like yeah. I said, they mm-hmm. charging him with some distribution like shit. Like popping Willie. Like yeah. my nigga, come on. Like it was just some bullshit. So after a while just it became some fucking. Yeah, it was yeah. like any, it was like anything they, they could do to violate probation. Yeah. probation is a leash. My <laughs> man wasn't even he really ain't do no wild shit. Like he hasn't legitimately committed a real crime since yeah. you know what I'm saying he got caught with a gun on. Yeah, so for him to be on probation for 10 years or 12 years, that shit's retarded. <laughs> they know Millie the killer. That's what he's <laughs> trying to get my nigga. <laughs> These niggas out here, wow. But yeah, I'm, I like, I always, the whole time, like, I was sitting here like, this nigga is, I know niggas who get in trouble because of probation and yeah. go back to jail, like, and he a rich nigga trying to fight that shit. And, fight like, and, yeah, and then to come right, find right. out that the case was on some bullshit. Yeah. Like, come on, bro. Let my nigga free, bro. But yeah, so, he can smoke weed now. He can do all that shit now. Yeah. Look at him. Look at man, a free man. So when you get a chance here, definitely take a look at that documentary. I'm so about you, to check that it out. It ain't even really just about him, you know what I'm saying? It's just, that shit just show you the injustice in the system, how that shit yeah. fucked up for niggas. And if a rich nigga like that going through that bullshit over some petty shit, Imagine what a bunch of thousands and millions of other niggas is going through. Damn right. You know what I'm saying? Bro, that's why I'm waiting for that this don't, That don't got the money or resources yeah. to... Know what I'm saying? That's why I'm waiting for this track. He about to let all this shit out on this track. That boy that went viral oh, yeah. with the beat oh, yeah. machine. And they crazy. said that when, when uh, Angela Lee said that uh, the song's called Free Meat, he gonna get on. He got with the nigga. They about to do the beat. The song called Free Meat. I said, nigga, that shit is gonna be yeah, crazy. Yeah, that's, a- that's gonna that's gonna be crazy because I know he gotta have some shit coming up. He got to. Uh, yeah. Gotcha, Matty. Yeah, he man. usually dropped for the summer. He Some dropped that summer EP that last time. Oh. Yeah. Um, but yeah, shit, man. Let's get into the to the topics, which is <laughs> definitely not following the flow of the of the show. But nah. these is the fucking topics. What we got today? So could slash would niggas wait till marriage? 
for what? <laughs> what? I mean, I'm trying you to. You know what the what? Hold up. Could like, you wait till I, marriage before you hit the pussy? Am I? And was I a child and a virgin at the time? Right now, at your current state, can we ask a serious in? topic? No, that's Is there a serious topic for a docket. No. Why? Why would you do that? Hey man, this is this is what I've been told to ask. All right? Oh okay. I mean, I don't. I mean, I don't see no point in it. Who? Which one of our viewers is that child? I mean, like I don't see no what what that's crazy. <laughs> Why would <laughs> y'all this really? Mad y'all, awkward, is, this mad a, fast. Not, is this a real thing? Like I just want to know. Like no, you I see really what I think? That, I really do. They really you, think bro. that this I is seen, a, bro? I seen a thread. And mad motherfuckers were saying yes and giving legitimate reasons. You why know they why they were saying yes, bro? To get the pussy down. Yeah, that's what the fuck, nigga. <laughs> nigga, you get a shorty can tell a nigga. You can tell uh, that a shorty can I tell mean, a nigga you ain't never getting this pussy, and some niggas will still I be guess. like, all right, whatever. Yeah. But nigga, three months like, later, yeah, like he got them knocking her back. You're like, all right. I'm like little, some niggas will put in all that work and do all that extra. Nigga, okay. Yeah. Peace. See you. I'm gone. <laughs> like, ain't nobody got time for that shit. I got three months. And that might be uh, real insensitive to some, but if you, don't, if you don't give it up with you three want months, it, I ain't got look, no women, point. Women <laughs> out of their mouth got told me that they want it more than we do. I, I heard women say that's that they want it more than we do. So I'm like, yes. shit, I, if I, I keep this dick away from you, your ass gonna go crazy. That's a motherfucking fact. And if you keep that pussy away from me, I might Ross, go crazy. So we Ross need to get that this shit, shit on submarines. I let you fuck get... me once. You want to make me yours? Yeah, I can't just be look. You got a ninety day rule, and I got a ninety day rule. Man. If I don't fuck you within the first ninety days, we not we ain't got shit to talk about. Yeah, shit. That but nigga, nah, that so, nigga said ninety. Nigga, nigga said, that's, that nigga that's said an extension. 90. Like that's I'm about to say, like, he gave. Hey, look, I'm sorry. I need that. <laughs> I need that. I need that up off you. We need to figure out if we gonna this gonna make yeah, the long yeah, run. <laughs> I need to know. I don't know why this shit carried on as long. Cause that one ain't really a topic. It shouldn't have been. It shouldn't have been. <laughs> like that shit. Why? Nah. The real first topic is: uh, Is this generation of society more moved by money or attention? Attention. That's attention what I, gonna, that's, attention that's gonna, what gonna I go bring money. Oh, that's what they think. That's how they. That's probably how they feel. Yeah. These kids is doing some of the wildest shit. Niggas was eating them dish detergent packs, bro. <laughs> And crazy. putting it on YouTube so to look cool and shit like, um, but YouTube, you think about this, white people, crazy. YouTube, they out there making money off the goddamn views and streams yeah. and all the other yeah. shit. Well, that's like, what I said. It's kind of a conflict because it's a combination of both. Like they're a lot more business savvy than the people above us were. They're probably yeah. a lot more business savvy than we are. We kind of learn from them a little bit too. Yeah. yeah. But I mean, now, like my nigga Nip said it best. Like now, nah, just own your own shit. You can yeah, do, you can do this shit. shit. Like, and that shit, that shit always stuck with me. Like, cause I'm sitting there looking like you can. These kids is real life, just doing whatever they see whatever the cool they shit is. Yeah. Like, we was taught certain shit. We seen yeah, the right. cool shit, but we had the way that we can be like, all right, nah, I'm gonna do this. I'm gonna do that. It's yeah. like they don't even got that in them. Like, yeah. if it's fuck getting, it, do it. if it's getting likes, if it's getting whatever, then fuck it. It's cool. I'm gonna do it. Like, That's goddamn. It. Uh, y'all kids stop that shit if y'all watching. Cut that uh, shit out. But yeah, no, nah, I think Tell your kids man, stop that you shit. Pay attention if you to have your a plan kids. behind your attention, like if you grabbing attention for money and you have a solid plan behind that, I can understand that shit. Mm. I can't knock it. But yeah, that's but, how the baby got on. Yeah. That nigga was in goddamn it. shows with diapers on and shit. It's now look at this nigga. Yeah. Mm-hmm. yeah, but I'm talking about society as a whole. I feel like it's more people that want attention and money because it's a lot of niggas that ain't on no kind of paper chase. Mm-hmm. But they getting they they doing the wildest the, shit for Facebook to get. Yeah, so you got the people on I mean? social media who do that shit. Look, yeah. some people some people like being the cool people. But but you always not cool to somebody else. Or you always like saying, it's it's like why why we're just be yourself. Like, like by a while, he's trying to be the cool nigga. That nigga he know it's over for him. He been and through he, it's and, over. And, for and him. it's never like everything he do to try to be cool is never some cool shit. It was over for him when he was at Lido's. Oh, <laughs> like, like I knew, I knew then. It's it's just no, cashing the check. I dropped the hot freestyle earlier. That this green, year, what that green shit. zone? I think green yeah, zone I six. Or now some I ain't gonna front like on him. He no, nah, I'm not. He, ta- he, he tried some shit, but I'm talking about outside of music. When like, the when the fake awesome. shit popped off, it yeah. was over. Yeah, yeah, when the fake shit popped off, it was over. You seen how Ti was like sunning him the other day when he was like because of whatever he said about Sierra. He was sunning like you can't do stuff like that. 
Yeah. Like, oh, he it's knows. just because the nigga, he just want attention, bro. Like Jermaine Dupri did, did the same too. thing, talking about yeah, women rappers right. only did that. We, we touched that. That was corny. Yeah, like that's like niggas do wild shit when they at the was, end. <laughs> when they at the was, end, niggas corny. do wild. Shit. Even if it was like his intention was like, oh, I, it's because I wanted them to bring the bars. Like nigga, that ain't that ain't how you do it. That's all publicity, good publicity. Yeah, for them it for is. For certain people. For them it is. For certain, on, for certain people. Depends on your lane. Because how, how much bad publicity has killed careers sometimes? You're right. So mm. it, it's for certain people, I guess. You know what I'm saying? Everybody, the people who live by that, it works for them. Yeah. Like Easy e and them, they yeah, love bad publicity because yeah. that shit, that shit helped them. That shit skyrocketed them. But man, for this too. certain other people, like that shit, bad publicity ain't good publicity. But yeah, so it just depends. I, that attention always go for the fucking money. That's Fuck me. That shit. I'm yeah. right now always. That's me because I don't have money. a lot of it. Like the you money, know that money, this nigga ain't say because money he don't give you. a fuck. He, nah. You seen you seen the size of this nigga crib when we pulled up, bro? It's <laughs> yeah. like a many, mansion in here. See how many you fucking yeah, 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 like a mansion. See how many acres we had. The nigga driveway is like mad acres and shit. So it's just like nigga, nigga. I done cut the yard, nigga. Yeah, see what I'm saying. That shit, that shit take time. How many days that shit took? The camera might have cut. How many days that shit took? Nigga, see how many days it took to cut the yard? Nah. That shit took some days with the hustler. Like, the nigga Bruh. was on the hustler and that shit took Nigga, some that shit days. do take some time, though. Nigga, that shit. And I, nigga, that nigga said, that nigga country said, I was about to hit goddamn cow. I'm like, that shit had a cookout over there and shit. Y'all can do the podcast. We can be doing the cookout and shit. He said, this nigga cow never hit me back. <laughs> he said, <laughs> he said, and you know what I just thought about? I told him we was drunk. I said, what? That nigga said, Nigga, we ain't hit that yard neither, nigga. It's been like three weeks. I was like, God <laughs> damn. I said, we ain't cooking shit over there. <laughs> I said, that shit. Yo, that nigga, nigga Slam bitch. did not respond in the I, group. Yo, I didn't I get the message, yo. I told I, I called country and I told him I didn't get the message. Yo. That's, that's, right? that's big money, though. You got big money. That That's big money. He that's know, how you know, you know a nigga lying. Him, if a nigga call you and tell Elite you he didn't get your plus. message, that means he got your message. <laughs> he just realized I didn't know nothing about the message until he told me he sent the message. And I was like, nigga, I didn't he said, we got to go over there and fight that shit. I came back out, and as soon as I pulled up, I said, yep. It's time. It's shit like a football field back there, bro. But, yeah, nah, man, it's like We're back big money, big, big money. He said it is pretty big. <laughs> Our backyard is pretty big. <laughs> yeah, we big know, money nigga, we know. <laughs> the house is small as a bitch, but it is. Nah, yeah, all right, man. Yeah. Rich nigga shit, man. I told you. Which, which garage this nigga said come in? Inside. This nigga got three garages. I told right. y'all. Y'all know I'm not lying I'm now. You, no, this nigga said come in the side, side garage. Like, he got the front garage. He nigga, got one in the I, back I started yard. looking to the side for cameras and shit. Friends and I was liars. like, damn. Liars. I said, damn, nigga. Nigga know. tell you hit the side door, nigga. You got to get ready. <laughs> like, like, damn. I was waiting to get buzzed in and shit. I was like, damn. Bug it. Yeah. This nigga got escorts and shit that meet you down at the end of the driveway and they got an escort I'm trying to live that 80 proof lifestyle. Yeah, man. I need some of that. Some... <laughs> I, I, at this point, I don't even know what to say to <laughs> Just let these niggas rock with whatever they want. So. All right. Well, what's the next topic? Well, yeah. What we got? So, no. Nah, so, we all agree. Attention. Mm-hmm. Everybody is more moved yeah, by yeah, attention yeah, than, yeah, than I, getting I money, agree. pretty much. I that shit is like that. a drug. I which one? I mean, that. which one do you prefer? Fame or money? Money. Money. I gotta have money. No, I would rather be rich and unknown than known and broke. I seen a cool. lot of famous broke niggas. And that no, shit I'm don't look like, good. It's right. actually worse to be niggas, known and broke. Niggas go home and cry, bro. Yeah, <laughs> niggas go home. They take their fake jewelry off no, and go home and cry. One thing bro, that's not gonna it. happen, I'd rather be like I said, I don't wanna be known and broke. Then you're not gonna Jay Holiday me. But no, money don't man. solve <laughs> everything though. <laughs> That nigga Here's the saying. valet key, bitch. I'm not valet. What the fuck? Not with this Gucci vessel. But Gucci I'm, vessel. I'm weak because he he was so shocked. He ain't know what to do. <laughs> that nigga ain't know what to do. And then he bucked like a little bit after that too because he was still mad. Like, nah, yeah, bro. Right. You gotta hang that shit up, bro. Yeah, like, bro. Like, you regular. As I, I would have been taken aback too. Like, how, who the who the fuck is just expecting somebody to just be like? <laughs> it's certain like, niggas that I rock you with. You valet? Bro. It's certain niggas shit. that I rock with. That's who, what I did. Who rich as a bitch, and, but and they don't talk like about. Eddie Griffin. 
The nigga got damn Billy Bob Thornton, bro. My nigga got money, and you don't see this nigga nowhere. Yeah. That nigga said, or like, I said, the interview Sandler, with that all nigga. Them niggas, like, niggas be like, yo, fuck Hollywood. Them good ass actors, like, who don't be fucking oh, with yeah. certain shit. Yo, yeah. so he was like, fuck Hollywood. It was like, but you was married to Angelina Jolie. The nigga was looking like, yeah, like she was a freak, nigga. Like, yeah. <laughs> like my whole, that was my old lady, nigga. Like, the fuck yeah. y'all saying? Y'all got cameras in our face and shit. Yeah. I don't like that shit. Angelina Jolie definitely like she get rim jobs. Nah, Angelina was goddamn dusting Billy Bob off. You seen what that nigga did yeah. to Holly, like, man? Like, I didn't know for You fact seen what that nigga did you. to Holly, yo? That shit was fucked up. I we know. had we had to eat that shit, and we was hurt about that shit. Too. I know Angelina Jolie get the gooch, man. She get up in that man, area real well. I'd say you fucking Angelina Jolie, and you about to have a sex scene That's with Holly mean. Berry. They is not yeah. gonna disrespect black people like this in front of me. I was ready to shoot he some hit, shit up. He hit Holly for real. Yeah, he he that jumped shit was her, really and ain't even take him ain't even take him less than two minutes. That nigga said, "Huh? What you say? <laughs> you say you want to what? what? Make you feel yeah. good? Oh, oh I got you. you. Don't even worry about that." I said, "God damn, this nigga stroke for like real. our queen, bro. He was in Holly for real. I said, that's our queen, bro. You just gonna dust her off on the couch. The raw like dog. That. He had a raw dog on the couch. With the birds fucking, they was, the birds I mean, was hungry. They uh, had no food in Number one, <laughs> Holly Berry throw that pussy. Who not hitting raw? Everybody. <laughs> Everybody. My nigga Eric, ben, my nigga Eric Benet was wildin', bro. Oh, yeah. <laughs> I'm tired of you not asking serious questions. <laughs> that's what I'm saying. It's like, niggas pointed out raw dog like that shit ain't just a given. Like, nigga, the only difference between me and him is Holly would have been pregnant. That's crazy. That nigga, yeah, man, that shit was tough. <laughs> I was I was like, fuck this shit. I'm a film watcher, and I wanted to turn that shit off so bad. Shit was filthy. I Yo, said, you, felt filthy like, you felt like Kid in House Party 2 when the wolf nigga kept taking, <laughs> <laughs> kept taking Sydney upstairs and shit. But when the, no, bro, when he got done, bro, and I looked at the nigga, I said, as a real actor, you a wild ass nigga. So I already know you just did this shit on some. Oh, y'all gonna pay me all this money to hit Holly Berry? <laughs> oh, it's shit. The, say it less. Off as acting say less. I'm, really about, to, I'm about to bust her shit. And the nigga hopped up after it was over with, did the rest of the movie. Like, I just got a bag. Like, nigga, I just got a bag. I don't care if this shit tank. That's some of the <laughs> illest nigga shit I've ever yeah. seen. He definitely walked like he ain't care if the movie tank. Uh, nothing. No, but he yeah. don't give a shit. He said, "Fuck Hollywood." Y'all the... gonna give me a bag to hit Hollywood? Who was the actual question? I'm positive, bitch. This one, we just this no, we just we kind of floated. <laughs> like, we just talking shit. We just kind of floated. Um, so the last, damn, this a wrap. You said Trevor, that's a wrap. Uh, yeah, you said that's it. They in pet peeves. Hold on, you said what? They in pet peeves. They impact peas. Like certain. Don't think much too much. Don't think too much. Yeah. Don't play defense. Play offense. I don't like. I don't like shorties that play defense. When, when goddamn, we going out. What I mean by that is, if me and a shorty go out and eat or whatever, like, mm -hmm. don't. I don't need none of that. Whatever you got in the back of your mind, let me see if this nigga ninety day rule. Let me. See this and it no rock with me vibe with me yeah. we gonna see how the fuck don't don't play that defense shit because then I'm a, I'm gonna catch it and, and then and my whole yeah. mode after that is gonna be on some whatever shit and I'm turning to Bill Belichick <laughs> that's it like, I'm going for the I'm going for yeah. the best though so I mean play offense ladies and niggas yeah. niggas like add aggressive shit yeah I mean real. I can see that though because most more joints is more so. They ain't even dating to really find a nigga. They, they, this bitches did really defensively dating. I mean, that's what it's it is. Like, they trying not to get hurt. That love shit hurt man, them. Man, they not they trying. Should've. What that they trying to do? Hurt, nigga. That love shit'll yeah. fuck you up. Well, Don't nobody nah. want none of that smoke. Facts. That shit'll fuck you nah, up. Nah, and that's and a so, fact. But I ain't go, But the thing but is. But that's what I mean. I feel what yeah. you're saying, though. Like, I don't. I'm looking at it like I feel why you doing that, but chill. That's not what we here for. Yeah, like that's, that's not what we yeah. here for. We here to vibe. Like get to know me. And then a lot of shorties for real, they they got that wall come down yeah. and they fuck with you. The coolest my and they be cool as a bitch. Then. And that's and that's yeah. just I can say that's uh, that's my only pet peeve for real. I ain't really got. It. I really ain't got too many, though. Yeah, mine, communi mine is poor communication, dog. If I'm talking about a joint, I'm really like trying to. Oh yeah, yeah. Rock with, you know what I'm saying? Like. Poor communication. This shit's so like, crazy because you yeah. gotta communicate. Inconsistency is gonna get you unconsidered every time. 
Shit. That's my shit, If though. I'm I really can't... trying to rock with you, if you just a joint, you know what I'm saying? We just Oh, yeah, go yeah. Out Inconsistency. Time, yeah, like... yeah. No, nah, no. Nah. Inconsistency is a big thing. Yeah, like, that's like, how... Yeah. I, like, I can't, I can't trust it. I believe yeah, what I really the hell you talking can, about. Like, yo. I got a problem. I'm, saying, you I'm so kidding. nonchalant and just chill. Yeah. Like, and that's, that's part of my thing, though, because once I see the inconsistencies, it's just like, all right, fuck it. And then I mean, now I'm the nigga that you figure out, but guy. you know like, I'm the one. Yeah, yeah, but I just be like, holler at me when you holler at me. Hit me up later. I tried to hit you two or three times. You know what I'm saying? You was busy and you back. They hate when you understand and you agree. Yeah. That shit crazy. Yeah, I mean, since like that, I can see. But now I'm saying it's just. I don't know, man. I don't care. Terrible like, that's you got I mean. a life. I'm nah, going nah. to get to you like I've been apologizing, nigga, lately. I'll apologize. I'm going to apologize, nigga. I'll just say, hey, look, if we can get this shit over with, like, you know I mean it. But if I just apologize right now, can you leave me the fuck alone? Because I got other shit to do. I'm not apologizing. <laughs> Straight up. I but I'm not talking about, about to argue with your dumb ass. Like yeah. that's what it is. Like, yeah, I definitely ain't got to apologize. I definitely ain't got to argue no, about if I fuck up. I'm talking oh, yeah, about if I fuck up. Yeah, if I fuck up, I definitely apologize. Oh yeah, yeah, you got it. Apologize because I ain't trying to argue either way. Like I fucked up. I'm sorry. I shouldn't do this shit. I won't do it again. I'm gonna try not to. Shouldn't be like, didn't I tell you to? You know what? You did tell yeah, me to do that. And I right. fucked up. And You're I right. That was my fault. Right. That's 100% my fault. Yeah, so I ain't yeah. gonna jump down, shorty, throw fucking question to me, bro. Like, what the fuck? Man, Niggas sometimes they ask you to do some shit and it just be, don't be the right time. They want you to do that mother no, shit but right some, then and there. But and sometimes, you got some shit going women, on. sometimes the women fuck with you. Yeah. Just to fuck with you. So they be like, let me see if you do this. And yeah. then you, you got to know them times when yeah. that's how you got to know your shorty you're dealing with. Yeah. Yes. You got to know the shorty you're dealing with. Because if you oh, know yeah. she's fucking with you, then yeah. you know. In that like, situation, yeah. Good. I can see that. So, I mean, it's well, a lot of. They will just see if you fuck with them the way that they, they fuck with you. Yeah. They'll that's, try that shit. If I'm vibing with somebody, I already know we got to be on the same level. Well, yeah. I'm yeah. a fucking goofball. I yeah, and that's you, another thing. The, like, sense of humor is important. But but you say the wrong thing, and I start feeling a little some type of way. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I'm going to let you know, hey, look, chill out, fam. Yeah. <laughs> hey, yeah. Chill out, fam. <laughs> we ain't playing no more. That's why you and can't what, And what a lot of women do, they were like, oh, you don't want to play no more? Yeah, yeah, hey, look, you better leave me alone. That's why oh, you can't you joke with women. Yeah. yeah. Like, women joke differently. You be like, shut the big balloon Because we're men. They be like, fuck they, you, <laughs> small dick nigga. That's yeah. why you can't make me come. And that's why your mama diabetes always acting up. I ain't never I heard like, that God before. Damn, I ain't like, never heard that before. Damn, I ain't like, that fuck? I ain't like, I've never heard that before nah, neither, but I'm just saying that's how women oh, play. Oh, this they nigga. go for neck shots. Whoever said that shit to my nigga Kyle. <laughs> I need nigga you to apologize you to this nigga, please. My nigga felt that. Any woman that I've ever dealt with in life has never said that. <laughs> that shit sounded more like a venting session than that. It did. It was more than all. Just telling y'all how women joke. You can't. Oh, nah, no, they, no, nah, no. They, oh, they gonna do that. They go for the jugular. They do that. And then you gotta tell them some shit that, that they insecure about. Like, tell them how they fucking, they wig. But you split. can't, because then you the wrong. <laughs> split yeah, you wrong. right here. Then you gotta talk about their mama. You then you gotta, you, gotta, you gotta hit them hard. You gotta talk about their mama. You gotta oh, ask him some shit like, "Are you sure James is really your daddy?" <laughs> Since you wanna, <laughs> you wanna joke. Is James really your daddy? I'm like, hey, look, I told you that shit in confidence. Now, <laughs> now you about to have to, uh, yeah. you about to have to get this flame. And, and what I, whatever I'm about to say is about to make you try to punch me in my face. Yeah, but I'm right. telling you, <laughs> you better. Oh, that's yeah. what. That's one that's thing. I don't do it. That's hey, why look, I don't. You know it. That's why I don't tell chick secrets, bro. Like I don't tell them like like personal secrets because they. In the joking session, they gonna bring that shit out. I got some. I got some women. A couple women. They like my best friend. Women. He's my best friend. Women. All of them got shit on me, and I got shit on all of them. But we know we'll never say nothing about none of that shit. Oh yeah, oh, now nah, yeah. that's the and and that's, that's different. different. And that's just like that's that's that's, that's like protecting your investment. I don't tell yeah. people nothing more than I want anybody. Man, like I don't. I don't be letting like, mm -mm. black men yeah. don't cheat ever. Yeah, that's so pretty I don't much know what that I just shit. said. Like, I ain't, what y'all was talking about? I ain't letting no, no secrets out. Cause... No, you know, you keep your shit to yourself. That's what you do with the fuck yeah, you yeah, do. Fuck <laughs> no, no, <laughs> I ain't got shit to the, say to nobody. The best, right. the best secret is the only shit Only person that, that knows is me, yeah. motherfucker. Yeah. <laughs> the it. best secret is the one that don't exist. That's it. If you know, you know. You tell me, yeah. I try to forget that shit. I really don't be giving a fuck. Yeah, I am trying to tell you, I don't be giving a fuck. <laughs> and don't no, I'm gonna no, keep it a hundred. Right. Most times when joints vent to me, and they probably ain't gonna do it no more after this. Too. Nigga, I put the phone on speaker and play the game. That nigga wild. Yeah. <laughs> he giving up. 
I ain't never did no shit like that ever in my life. Oh, I mean, I have. I have. Yeah, you, you ain't never heard that old rule like y'all niggas just, wild. If you kind of repeat like the last three or four words of the sentence so yeah. you think you're listening. I that just shit put really it, works. Because most of the time, they don't really want you to know the shit that they saying. They, they just, just need talk. to get it out. Yeah, just want to talk. So they don't give like a I fuck if you. Like I said before, I've never heard none of that <laughs> shit. I've never done no shit like that. That's wild. You out here lying? Nobody. No, so we lie. Hey, bro, one thing we don't do on this podcast is lie. Look, I'm not. I like. I'm I not gonna listen to every word that come out of your mouth. Like I I'm gonna said. pick up on the context oh, of the conversation. Most and times, I'm gonna pick up on the key words. Listen, most I ain't, times, I ain't no never listen. done that. Most times, I'm not listening to every single word when it's some shit I want to hear about. So some shit I don't want to hear about. Oh no, I listen. Ooh. I listen to what they talking about and I take it in. I diagnose it. You know, I think is she really so, uh, fucking crazy? Any positive <laughs> words for the is she fucking crazy? Lying ass <laughs> nigga. Any positive <laughs> words? I filter out the bullshit. <laughs> The thirty percent of shit that I need to hear is what I keep. That's it. Everything else is gone. This nigga here is a nigga here. Boy, I tell you. So we gonna put in the comments. Uh, I need y'all to vote if this nigga is a liar or not <laughs> for that bullshit he just said. We know he's a liar. He's it's a gonna liar. be a hundred yeses. Niggas <laughs> don't know shit for sure because I keep all my fucking secrets. Right. That's why. Well, whatever. <laughs> Whatever the public decide, nigga, that's what the truth is gonna be. Nah, yeah, damn. <laughs> but nah, positive yeah, words for the week. Since you the since you the motherfucking special guest, you started uh, off. Man, take care of your kids. The same shit I said Yo, last time. Niggas gotta start taking care of your kids. Yeah, niggas yeah. really gotta start doing that, man. Fortunately, nobody that we hang out with. These, take care of their kids, yeah, everybody man. take care. Nah, We're wonderful yeah, fathers, man. man. But like I'm saying. If you not, man, these kids, uh, they coming up wild, man. These niggas, day in, day out. Them people in El Paso, them people in goddamn... Uh, I don't want to have to beat your son up if he ain't got no daddy to defend himself. And these niggas out here wilding, man. Raise your fucking kids, right? Like they got some yeah. goddamn yeah, sense. Just, that shit ain't got shit to do with no fucking El Paso. Nigga, we grew up with our fathers. We ain't out here shooting shit up. Nah, I'm talking Yeah, about. I don't... We not we not going to give them niggas that scapegoat. Because how many niggas in the hood ain't mm, fucking fuck. did a mass shooting? That don't man, got no father in their life. Man, Fuck it's, all it's that. a lot of niggas running around that ain't. And you, they doing shit like they ain't got no father in their life. These kids coming out fucked up. This dope yeah. is fucking these kids up. I'm telling you. That's because most of these niggas is that junkies. Shit, that shit crazy, man. It's, it's cool to be. A, crazy. It's cool to be a junkie now. That's because most of these niggas is junkies. So niggas is faked out. This is supposed to be positive, man. How we start talking about niggas being fools? Because Cause we need, need to, we want them to do better. Oh yeah, yeah. We want them to do this better. This is for your kids. I'm telling you, we need we need all the help we can get. They out here slaughtering us for real, niggas, <laughs> putting us in jail, <laughs> doing all types of shit. Niggas went from mm. wanting to be plugs to just being plucks. Man, that shit crazy, man. Yeah. And then it's happening right here in our neighborhoods, in front of our faces. Like this shit, wild, man. So everybody need to come together. Make sure everybody doing good and got and protect your loved ones. R.I.P. to all the few we done lost in the past couple of weeks, man. Yeah. So uh, y'all, our prayers is with y'all. Our prayers Big is with facts. everybody. So R. you, it's, it's people out here that love you and that's supposed to be positive. But I mean, this yeah. is positive energy coming to you. Don't yeah. keep your head up. R.I.P. Like, to know. Stevie too, man. That shit kind of yeah, fucked me up a little that. bit. That shit fucked me up a little bit. Just heard about that. She was so. cool. She was one of the Cool ass female, man. And with that being said, yeah. I wish everybody out here in VA much success. And good health. Because my I'm ass is goddamn going to Houston. Justin Houston. Yeah, I'm about to get there. I'm going to be to Houston to fuck it up. I can't wait to go visit. I can't wait to go visit this nigga. I can't, wait, go I can't, I can't nigga. wait. Shit going to get out of control. <laughs> Look, Giovanni probably had to come out there and have another pool party out here. Yeah, I can't wait to come hey, visit look. this nigga. But yeah, man, that shit is gonna be love, man. I love all y'all, man. Yes, sir. Kyle, positive uh, words. Um. Damn, I got no positivity, yo. I mean, it be like that. I always got. What type Kyle. of nigga is you, man? You just not just just not positive. Just everything. Man. Nah. Just a- uh, try to eat healthy this week, man. Try something different in your life. That. I'm gonna try that. I'm, I'm fat and, and trying to cut some weight out. So try try to do something different in your life. Yeah man. yeah man. Uh, people don't take uh get them pounds off, baby. Yeah. yeah, people don't take uh health serious. Shout out to all the women that was at the pool party too yesterday. Y'all was looking very exquisite. I mean Lord Jesus, some of y'all built with them thighs and Whew. Yeah. Y'all should definitely showed out. I was in the house like the videos and names will be concealed. 
for the innocent. Yeah. yeah. So. Ja, what you got, man? What's your positive note? Fuck Hit everybody. God damn. No, I'm just... <laughs> I feel you. Damn. FT Dub, fuck the world. No, no, that's what I, I think I just about said, it. Damn. What I meant by that is mm -hmm. you can't keep. You can't set yourself on fire to keep everybody else warm. Sometimes you got to say fuck everybody to take care of yourself to gotcha. get yourself right. Not saying fuck them like you just fuck mm -hmm. everybody, but yo, like mm -hmm. if it comes to my, my mental health and my peace of self, like nigga, fuck everybody. Let me get me right first because you can't take care of nobody else if you ain't taking care mm -hmm. of you. That's, that's so, law. That's, that's law right there. You can't take care of nobody unless you're taking care of yourself. That's it, so. Don't don't starve trying to feed the village, cause if you die, the whole village gonna die if you the one that's feeding everybody. So that's just what it is. My nigga just went back to the Apache days. Yeah, it was real deep. Yeah. Even thinking about that shit all fucking yeah, week. You heard that? He, the nigga recited the shit like the nigga been practicing. Yeah, dang. Yeah, a little bunch of rhymes and shit in there. You know, yeah, you can rap yeah. Time. Usually that's what I thought he was gonna come on with some bars, but my nigga came out that's with it. the goddamn that's Professor Ogle. It's just a mixtape verse. This is what it is. That's what, that's what we doing. <laughs> they give you a mixtape verse at the end. Hey, damn, that's, nigga. What, that's what the fuck we're doing. Them take care of their kids. You tell them get their life together. Like, <laughs> we want y'all to be positive, man. Laugh, laugh right. more. Oh, I, I, I'll be life. I, fuck it. I'll be ignorantly positive. Get money, fuck bitches, and eat food. That's all you gotta do. <laughs> Your life will be so much less stressful. <laughs> Till next time. <laughs> <laughs>